Yo, yo, what's good, what's good? Welcome to another Fishing Plan Streaming Week. I'm not sure what's going to happen today. But let's just say that, uh, you know, after the, the secret patch note with Weeping Willow being bugged out, now it's back to normal. It's the same thing with Blue Cup Island. Back in the days, tarpons weren't biting on much frogs or live baits that much anymore. So I did some offline testing, it was going good. I was getting uniques every day I fished. Now I'm here live. I want to see how it's going to operate. I'm down to go get some uniques and, you know, let's see what happens, man. So with that said, welcome to another stream. And I hope you'll enjoy it, man. Tony, DD, and Michael, welcome to the stream, bro. Hope you're having a wonderful day so far. Okay, as you guys can see, I'm at... The Amazonian maze judging from my last upload fishing planet guide I was here fishing for the the flag tailed so you know I've been fishing here and there offline doing the the guides not streaming though so we get we're gonna get some rods to go and uh, go fishing wait natural is there yo natural welcome to the stream man <laughs> how you been doing bro Not going to lie, it's kind of late for me to be streaming Fish on Planet right now, but uh, let's do it anyways, you know? Why not? Okay, that need to be going. We need some match fries, some more match fries with us. Oh, yeah, definitely. Can you tell me why I earn small amount of cash? I catch like a lot of trophies and even your guide and set up. You told me you can use feather light, something rod, or a spoon. I don't know what you've been doing, bro. But if you've been doing all that at Falcon Lake Grinding, you should not be broke or you should be making a lot of cash by now. So I'm not sure what's going on, but you're doing something definitely wrong, man. Look at my leaderboard for Belugas. Give me a second, let me check these, let me get these rods going, and uh, we can check all that. Yo Moose, what's good bro? <laughs> hey man, what's the word? Yeah, I was going to do this offline and then stream after, but honestly it was too late for me to do that, so... I just gonna be the winner there, you know. And small minnows as bait. Is there any other bait I should use? At this moment, small minnows are your best option. So you can use shiners too, but those are expensive. The small minnows are way more affordable and they're really good. One question, can we do party? Normally I don't do party chat while I'm streaming. So maybe that have to be offline like after stream, you know. If it's important right now, Tony, let me know. And uh, my bad, y'all. I'm doing this all right now. But you know, you guys are normally streaming on weekends. Where I do have more time to do everything. So I wasn't planning to stream today, not gonna lie to you guys. But I've been getting comments when it's gonna be live streaming, so why not right now, you know? No, all good just for fun. Uh, definitely, bro, we can uh, start a party chat after the stream ends, you know, if around or you still buy. The tattoo says trying to deep unique tarpon. Yo, talking about unique tarpon, bro. Yo, you guys missed out on the day I caught a marlin in stranded deep, bro, and I swam way to land, getting attacked by shark, boars, snake, just to get on land with a big ass marlin, bro. Crazy, man. You guys missed that action. I need a bottom rod. Where is it? 
That'll be late for me. Well, you know, whenever you have time, just um, shoot me a message, bro. I'm not always on this account, so I might see it late, but you can always send over a message, and that way I can see when you're online as well, you know? Competition? Eh. Maybe sometime, bro. You know I'm not really a big fan of competition, bro. Takes way too long and it's just pure orangey and luck, bro. Things like that I don't really enjoy doing, you know. But we can try sometimes. Shall I use day peak? Or night? Day peak, bro. Like, day peak is way better and by the time that the day ends, you can almost skip. As I said, Michael, if Arthur was here right now, he just started like two weeks ago. You guys see him in chat now and then, Arthur. And he's level 30 by now, bro. And over like 100k in cash. Fishing Falcon late, bro. Trust me. He's been doing the grind. Okay, we need to get this thing going, bro. So, as I said, I'm not sure what's going on on your hand, but... You're like the first person to say you're fishing Falcon Lake and nothing good is happening, bro. Actually. I mean, I showed you on the stream, bro. I showed this part and everything. The way those fish bite, Unix fast trophies. And you said that spot is not working for you. You're not making cash there. I'm not sure what's going on, bro. Yo, K13, what's good, man? Welcome to the stream, bro. Hello, today I was playing Fishing Planet for Big A Carp and Silver. Got seven Unix. Hell yeah. How big were they? You know, any new person best? I'm gonna just carry one match bottom rod just because you know, we don't really need it that much. Since we're going for tarpons, you know. So. 29 kg. Uh, that's 60 pounds, if I'm not mistaken, or 60 plus pounds. Okay, guys, just give me a minute. Let me get this thing going. We need some hate talks talks over here, bro. For the drums. You know, I can't go to Blue Crab Island without getting some drums in the meantime as well, you know. 61. Oh, hell yeah. Hey, K13, question, bro. Have you ever tried oversized carp mix for bigger than silver carps before, bro? I, I promise you. You want to try that, bro. You're going to be you're gonna be getting like 102 pounds, 105 pounds carp, bro. Monsters. Yeah, they do go crazy for them, bro. Yeah, I did some stream back in the past and some videos. And I, I'm telling you, bro, I caught some nice big ones, man. <clears throat> the leaderboard. Hey, you got the hold up, Tony. Like, you know. We just started. I should be fishing, but I'm here making the rod. So when I have the time to, I'll definitely do that, bro. Can't do so many things at the same time, you know. And I'm pretty sure you guys are here to watch me go fishing, so. We gotta go fishing. Uh, let me buy some more baits. Yeah, I hate starting a stream like this when I'm just making the rods and everything, but hey. Uh, is it my rod? Welcome to the stream. When fish and plant update, C map. Uh, I'm not sure, but I must say most likely in the in the summer, you know, in a few months. Yeah, it had to be somewhere around that time, bro. Not gonna lie to you. What are you going for? I'm going for some tarpons, man. You know, a few months back, you fish with live baits in Blue Cup Island. And let's just say that they weren't biting. You're getting trophies, but Unix weren't biting, you know? So, ever since the secret patch where they fix Weeping Willow, the carps are now biting again. 
the tarpon should be back and I've been there recently. I got some units in two days rotation. So I decided, you know, to let the rest of the testing be in the stream. Back to the river. So we're going to go there today to go for some unique tarpons, you know, and see how many we can get now. If it was just a fluke or they're back for good, you know. Okay, fish. The biggest beluga is 159 pounds. That's the oversized one. You can't tell me that kid wasn't trying to catch oversized belugas with oversized mix, bro. There you go, Tony. What's good, man? You on the leaderboard? Finger mullet is working for tarpon. Finger mullet. I never tried that before. My top recommended bait are scale sardines, large minnows, and crabs. But um, finger mullet, never tried it before, bro. Not gonna lie to you. Um, first, maybe because I just started playing, it doesn't upload as yet, you know, our update. So we can check back after. Or maybe when you were there first place, they removed you after because they do that, bro. They will do it. The leaderboard is weird where you can get the biggest fish in the entire game. And within a few days, they remove it and place it with a random catch that's smaller than your fish, bro. You know, it's weird, man. Today I got Tarpon 19 kg on Everglades. I used to love the Everglades back in the days, man. Not gonna lie to you. That's one map I actually like, but never really fished that much, you know? For a map with so many bass there, bro. Okay, let me see what these players are catching. Let the game load in. It's gonna lag a it's gonna lag a bit to watch this. 32. Oh nice knock. No tarpons though. Hey. Right. We are ready to go, man. And you guys know we're going straight to the main spot just because you can use all rods there. And uh this spot is not the best to be honest. The boat dock. I never really have much luck at the boat dock before. Oh, I loved it. The sunrise, bro. Can you join me? Wait, you fishing right now, Tony? I know tomorrow is Saturday. And uh, I'm not sure I'll be fishing tomorrow. On the stream. But who knows man. Where is Michael by the way man. He's been saying I should stream but he's not here. What's going on. Yeah. PC bro. PC, Xbox, Playstation. They can't play together you know. I don't know, I kind of feel like a, a, a public vibe today. I want to see what players are catching as well. <clears throat> hey Tony, try joining me. It's going to put you in a public session. And when you get the public session to be in, let me join over, bro. So join me and then when it's, when it's going to put you, it's going to put you in a public session, right? By yourself. And then I will join after. That way players can join you. Because I want to see what everyone else is catching, bro. How much gold coins do you had? have? So I had at least 1,600 last couple of months. But I've been wasting them by skipping days, you know. Did you put money? I don't know, bro. On Fishing Planet, the only thing I ever bought in Fishing Planet was the Congo and... Uh, Mongolia just for the content to get the guys out early other than that. I don't really spend money fishing planet, bro Not gonna lie to you 
One second, guys. Yo, Otto, welcome to the stream, bro. I was talking about you earlier in the stream as well, you know. What's good, bro? Wait, what? It's, okay. Okay, we may. Am I in front of anyone? Most likely, prayers are fishing here, bro. Most likely. Oh, come on. Where are they at? I see one right there. That's me. So, and the other Michael is there too, man. Yo, you guys gotta change your names though. Like, I don't want to be saying Michael, but it's like responding to the other one, you know. I want to say Michael, but you guys know who I'm saying or who I'm talking to, you know. I'm just kidding. You guys don't have to change your names. I'm just saying that. Don't get confused when I'm saying. Michael at the same time Just know like I'm responding to the recent one, you know Welcome to the stream, bro Okay, let's go crazy guys you've been here watching me for like uh, last 20 minutes, right? No, 16 minutes Let's go crazy Hey, yo, Tony, when, what, when are you gonna be streaming, man? When are you gonna be live streaming Fish and Plant? I think I should be oh one hour talk. Crazy. Hell no. Nah. Should be ten. There you go. Unless I should be putting the scale sorting on the bigger rod, you know. Yeah, let me just put this one over here. Large windows over here. Just because. Bad news in four weeks. What bad news? And uh Michael Gaming. Otto is in the in the in the lobby, bro. You can ask him any questions right now when he's fishing at Falcon Lake. Ask him ask him anything you want, bro. And you'll be surprised the answer you get from him. Uh salute them. Mm, nah. Yes, sir, we're going for the tarpons, you know. Not like that's the only fish you're gonna be catching though. You can't you can't pass these snooks, pyramids, you know, stuff like that, so yeah. If any of you guys been fishing here lately with uh the match rod, not recently though, like for the past few months, the tarpon uniques are not biting that much, you know. But you know I think they could be back, so why not go testing them today, you know? Did they test for an off stream? And as I said, we caught some tarpon. But sometimes you guys want the full proof of what's going on, you know. Yo, DD, what's good, bro? Like, I haven't seen you in months, man. I heard that you unsubscribed as well. What happened? Hey, yo, Otto, you in the chat, bro? I'm not sure why this part of Falcon Lake for Michael is not working. But, like, that's the best spot in the game, like, right there. It's not the best as in, like, the only spot to fish. But it's, like, you know, the fastest and the most fish spot. Everyone go to catch fish, bro. So I'm not sure why it's not working for you. But hey man, something is off, you know. 
I know I got girlfriend in school and going <laughs> through certain things. Uh, so you're facing life then, huh? You're experiencing some things in life and, uh, you know, you're taking your time to to get through them. So, I understand, man. I just happy to see you on the stream and you seem to be doing good, you know? I'm not going to assume that you're good, but you seem that way. Okay, what fish is this, y'all? Big man thinks. <laughs> yeah, you better chill out, bro. Auto might be busy. It might be back in a few, I'm not sure. It's a permit. Hmm. I don't know. Could be. Could be. I right, question Tony, how many tarpons have you caught with those bottom rods, man? I'm not sure if I'm the only one who noticed this, but uh here. Bottom rods don't really work that good for tarpon, if that's what you're going for. I don't have I don't have much luck on the bottom rods, bro. Not gonna lie to you. Not saying they can't. I'm just saying that they're not fast enough when they come on to the the bottom rods, you know. One. Why am I lagging, bro? I don't think this is a unique right here. It's not fighting like one. If it is one, it's like an undersize. The thing is, I've been getting 120 uniques when I've been testing, so it's kind of weird, man. Like, I haven't seen the 130s, but uh, that should be around. Good luck, bro. I'm leaving the stream. Bye, bro. IK13, take care, man. You know, and uh, stop by whenever you can again. Just under 15 days made 160k at Sun Wicking Delta. Oh, hell yeah. It depends on how long you're fishing though, Michael. You know? If you've been grinding that place that good, like, you know, regularly, you could be making over 20k within a few hours in real life. I've done it, I've done it before, you know? And I'm pretty sure you can do it as well. Maybe though you're just taking time off, fishing now and then, and that's it, you know. Fishing plant loves PlayStation. Why you say that? I just unlocked Sanokin Delta. I'm level 34. Do you recommend me to go and form a surgeon or wait? 34. Honestly, bro, I don't think you have the right rods to fish surgeon. Because they're gonna be take they're gonna be taking a lot of time. A lot of time to uh to get them in however though if you have like strong match rods or bottom rods you can do that if you don't i would say you should wait some more you know yeah because you're gonna be needing those come on game don't do that you're gonna be needing those strong rods to get the fish in you know One second, guys. What's this permit? D, shall I use my purple bar bless nor spoon or shall I use the white shad? No, sir, not the shad. Use the spoon. Yeah, no shads, man. Use the spoon spinners for for our uh, trouts, man. A lot of cat boxer. Our bottom chasers for the XP. I used to fish with the cat boxer back in the past, but uh, at the moment when I got mines, I did not have the right reel for it. So it was kind of unbalanced when I was using it, and it was pretty good. 
way stronger than the bottom snipers, but less XP when it comes down to the smaller fish, you know? At 38, 39 level in the game, you should be available to buy the cat boxer, the bottom sniper. But the thing is, as I said, the cat boxer might not have the right reel to go with it, bro. So my recommendations are the bottom snipers. With those things, you're getting the, the most and the best XP from all the fish caught on them. That name sound Jamaican, not gonna lie to you. Uh, maybe not though. Kind of sound like Jamaican name. If I'm pronouncing it right, you know. Kind of. That's that's crazy though. I don't think I ever played with another Jamaican playing this game. Or ever met one. Which is weird. I did a comp against Rodrigo. How did it go, man? If you only have 35 pound rod, it's probably best to get a kayak because the surgeons can get 50 pounds. Yeah, I think he cannot actually get one of those. The thing is though, Michael, like, I tried kayak fishing before. It worked. But then they did a patch to it where it takes way longer to fight one in it. So I'm not sure if they changed it back to what it was, but yeah, that can work, man. Kayak fishing with um, sergeant, that can work. First place against the pro competitor. Hey, that's really good right there. What's this catfish? Nah. Red drum maybe. Okay, the peak time is still fresh, no unique so far, and uh no one else been getting any. But it's not too late, you know. Why am I lagging bro? Damn. I'm going to try to go to Alaska map, this run, I'm going to go for some salmons, ooh nice bite, nice bite right there, or maybe not, I can't say it did look like a nice bite earlier. Chinooks are good for XP. And so are the other fish too, man. If you can farm the other uniques, like the bull trout, the Livarden, with the right set up rods and a reel, you can be getting tons of XP, bro. Oh my god, catfish. Yeah, yeah, we don't want to see that. Why am I first seeing it gonna be a catfish, bro? Crazy. I think I should be the right depth, right? 30 inches.
I went from Sun Wakin Delta to Blue Cup Island. No warehouse. Wait, wait, Didi, what level are you right now, bro? I am currently fishing or playing Fishing Planet, the fisherman, because I got it from a stream st sale. It cost me like three dollars with all the DLCs. Oh hell yeah! So you got all the DLCs, including the latest map, which is Blue Crab Island. I see one with his nice uni. Nice one, bro. I mean, I call 64 making alter. Honestly, bro, you shouldn't. You should not be be making a alt account when you're not max levels yet. You know, you're just giving yourself more work. To be honest, man. Yeah, because it's gonna be like you know why why start it right now? Why start and finish the job off? Way you know when you're so close. Yeah, but it's so cheap because of my country or economy. I mean, you know, I heard good things about the game. I heard bad things about it, man. You know, I would like to play it myself and see. So you getting that game that cheap for sale? Hey, that's good news right there, you know. And even better with all DLCs too. Damn, bro. There you go, come on. Yeah, not a tarpon. My Xbox isn't working correctly and my main stuff is on there. I have got MW2 on my PS5 though. Hey, yo, Didi, you've been doing glitches on the Xbox, man. What's going on? Why is it not working? I know you've been doing some funny stuff, you know? So I'm not gonna put it past you. I know you've been trying some stuff over there. <laughs> oh, I hate when Pete and get dark here. I hate it. In the past, when I realized that the tarpons weren't biting on the, on the debates, match rods and so on, I was going to make a video of it. But for some reason, I held back, like, you know, I didn't do it. I waited to actually see if they're going to fix it. So I didn't jump straight towards saying that they nerfed the map or something is wrong with it. So hopefully it's back, man, not going to lie. Okay, I don't think this is a unique either. I think I got hardware banned to the point to ban my Xbox from turning on. Mm, I don't think a ban will turn off your Xbox. That might be like, you know, something wrong with the, the game itself. Yeah. They can ban the account, but not the PlayStation itself, man. I don't think so. It turns on, then turns off. Okay, it might be overeating, bro. So you might want to check for the, you might want to check for the fans, the radiator, or the the heat sink thingy. You might need to apply some thermal paste to it. Yeah, I think that's a problem, man. Whenever your PlayStation or Xbox turns on and off, it's like overeating or something like that. 
Yo, Fark, what's good, bro? There was a secret patch. Okay, so the reason why I say secret patch, keep in mind they fixed Sweeping Wheeler, right? And there was no update that I know of that they said they fixed the, the map. There was no update in my opinion. I, I, I never seen one or I heard of one. Well, I did heard of one, right? But I didn't see it myself to say yes, it was here. So that's why I said it's a secret patch note. I doubt if uh, the other players in Fishing Plane notice that uh, Weeping Willow is back again, bro. I doubt most of them know that or notice it. Old, I see it's an old Xbox, bro. As I said, it might be overeaten. Yeah. So, you know, I'm just the one saying it's a sacred patch, bro. That's just how I see it, man. So, what you been doing, Fork? You been, you know, you been good? Been doing any competitions lately? What's the word? Let it chill for a week, and I completely, and it completely took, oh, you completely took it apart. Put it back together. With my dad, nothing was damaged or broken. Hey, yo, Didi, sometimes the, the problem is just a small problem, bro. It's not even noticeable. So, you know, as I said, it might be the thermal paste. It's just something you have to add on the, the, the what they call it, CPU or the GPU of the game. Oh, my hardware is going off too, bro. But I would say research it, bro, and you're going to see what I'm saying. Bro, why the hell when I get fish on the bottom rod? Wait, 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 wait. Fish, I hold button for reeling so hard because I think I reel faster. And I bet there is a day when I will hold it toward that to explode. Now nah, I don't think so, bro. Okay. First unit right there, baby one, but hey man. That's one down for the count, you know. And Tony got his permit as well. Yes, sir. I keep it up, keep it up, keep it going, you know. Michael said uh Bottom rods, you talking the feeder rods, bro? Surprising that you're not getting the trophies and the uniques, but the fish are fighting like crazy for you. Unless you switch into to something like that's that's weak, you know, a different rod or something. Because the only fish at the Falcon Lake that should be giving you a fight are the Trophy Brown and uh, the unique Rainbows, man. Been altering Call of the Wild, mostly. New map dropped a few days ago. Uh, I think you said the Australian map, if I wasn't mistaken back then. Was that the map you they dropped? Bro, as I said, I'm talking to the recent Michael in the, in, in, in the chat, you know, the recent one. That's who I'm always responding to. Oh, so it's the Australian map then. So, how is it so far, you know? Good hunting? Is it what you expected it to be? Or is it different? My birthday was uh, 10 days ago. I got a 360 or 3060 PC. 
and the 144 Hertz monitor. Oh, you're living the life, bro. You're living the life, man. I wish I had a 3060 money, uh, PC. The amount of gaming I could be streaming on that, bro, or, you know, stuff like that. Crazy. Was it a trophy rainbow or a unique? There's a chance of us getting another unique today. Could there could be a chance, but I'm not sure. I don't wear a card two uniques in one day before, but that is something that rarely happened. You have to be lucky enough for that to, that to happen. Really fun. The crocs are very fun because they're very aggressive. Oh, crocodiles are in the game too. Oh hell yeah! And sneaks up on you even kangaroos will attack you also kangaroos so are we talking about some like you know how big are the crocodiles though that sounds really interesting bro not gonna lie to you Harper like to bite on red worms, no cap. I know in real life they do bite on red worms. Where I'm from, they do go for red worms in real life, bro. So, in the game, never done it before. But I, I think it can work, bro. Like, if you're lucky enough to get them biting on it. The first time I seen or, and heard of a tarpon biting on red worm in real life, I was like, no. There you go for like, you know small finger mullets or bloody baits but uh the actual bite on red worms man in the game not so sure you know but not not impossible over two thousand pounds that, that's a ton right two thousand pounds is a ton if i'm not mistaken holy crap bro I would love to see some uh, gameplays of that uh, type of hunting for the, the crocodiles, you know. DOA, that's dead or alive. Is that what that means? They did a good job with the models too. Very realistic looking. I think I'm missing out to be honest, Spark. I heard about gators and was like, yep. I want, I want some of that, you know. Yes, yeah, so I was right then. It's a ton. So I said, come on. What was he aiming for? What fish were you trying to get, Tony? Oh, look at this crap, bro. Like, am I the only one getting this type of glitch right now? Weird, man. Really weird. Yeah, there's a gator on Mississippi map and the crocs in Australia. Oh. And uh 
the game is also multiplayer, right, Fork? You can play with friends and stuff like that too, right? Blood, drums, and tarpons. As I said earlier, Tony, you, you can't really, you know, even though you're going for those fish, you're going to be getting the other Unix too, bro. It's a must, you know? Well, we're getting somewhere 2,665 cash for 15 kilos of fish. Uh, extended day is 900 cash. 900 for 20 small minnows. Oh, man, is doing all the maths right now. Everything. <laughs> oh, snap. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> Honestly, bro, just buy a reasonable amount of small minnows, so like a hundred or so, because you're going to be making back the cash, bro. You're making it back, you know, unless you're just fishing somewhere that's not giving you back what you're putting in, you know. This, that's the same bait Otto been using. Small minnows, one art hooks, and he's being slain uniques and trophies, bro. So I'm not sure if it's an Xbox thing where it's not that active in that area for you. But those base should be the best ones you have right now. And the small... Oh my god. Did I max drag that thing? And the shiners, you know? When did I max drag it? Oh, I lost a buzz bait and the X-series names, bro. Really? Crazy. Yeah. Responding back to everyone and not paying attention that that's why lots of fish right there And that's just fishing, you know The good thing is we have some other stuff we can use as well damn I Really do hate to lose in lures bro that are Bitcoin or not easy to come by after you lose them One second bro And I don't think it was a tarpon, it was a drum. I'm not afraid of losing the buzz bait. What I'm afraid of losing are the X-series names, bro. These things right there. It was Max Drag. Yep. I hate losing my red worm, so expensive. Tell me about it, bro. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no way, DD. Yeah, come on, man. Oh, so there is multiplayer then. Okay. But multiplayer is only with PS Plus subscriptions. Yeah, you know, as usual. PS Plus, man. Hey, Fark, have you tried that Stranded Deep game as yet, bro? Have you thought about it as yet? I do want to continue Stranded Deep, but honestly, when I do continue it, it's going to be me going after the monsters. The Leviathan, uh, what's it called? I think it's called some Leviathan something something. But I'm talking the Megalodon shark, the 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 Kraken, and the 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 Mori heel. I want to go get them on stream, but I'm not sure when to stream it. You know, not too sure. Not yet, but I will. Yeah, I think it should be reason reasonable price. I think it should be. The next stream though, I will be getting all those monsters in it. Hopefully. PS Plus and Xbox is BS. People are already paying for games. What else do you want? I man, the gaming industry is just basically making cash, you know. They're making games for us to be playing 
something more satisfying to us, you know, so, stuff like that, enjoyable. But in return, they're making it for cash, bro. So, you know, if there's a way to make the cash, they're going to use that way to make it as much as they can. Nothing in this world is for free. Even when it's for free, it's not for free, man. Just like Fishing Plant, you get the game for free. However, though, at some point, you're going to be spending cash on the game. At some point. So, as I said, it's for free, but it's not for free at the same time. Trying to release in summer. That's what I'm hoping for. You know, that's my thoughts on when it should be releasing. Or when it should be released. But, hey man. No hard proof or evidence on my side. So, I can't really say. I'm just hoping for that to happen. And, uh, welcome to the stream, man. Sounds awesome. I'll try to catch a stream. I sure you hope. I, I hope you, you do, you know. I will surely be doing some monster um, hunting that day as well. Definitely. Because so far we got the fuel going. We got the boat. We got the engine. So, you know. We basically right at the point where we should be trying to get off the islands now. At level 50 to 55, this map and uh, Weeping Willow are the two competing maps for players to fish and grind levels. The biggest difference between them is that one map, you can just grind Unix there all day, non-stop. The others, I mean the other map is just plenty of other fish, you know, plenty of other Unix. You can fully kidnap it there. Tons of Unix, but you know, it's not guaranteed where you're going to be getting back to back Unix, you know. So, what I'm saying is that, you know, Weeping Willow, you go there with the right mix. That's all Unix every day you fish there. However, though, you have to be using mix, bro, to make it happen. Which some mix are not. How can I say this? not available until level 60 you know on the other hand blue crab island in my opinion i would say it's better when it comes on to like you know xp wise it's just way slower when it comes on to uni grinding i know most players might be disagreeing with me but I've done the testing and I've seen the results here. And to keep in mind, y'all, yeah, whenever there's a bigger map ahead of a smaller one, it means that that map is going to be giving a bigger unique and more XP, you know? And that's what it is. Weeping Willow is level 50, Blue Crab Island is 55. So you guys see the gap between both maps, you know? But they do got different um, circumstances where one map might be better than the next one. Hey Tony, you should be streaming, man. You see all this fishing you've been like doing and missing these uniques and and uh on stream. You should be doing it, man. You're missing all the content right now. Sunset so too small. <laughs> hey man, a unique is a unique, bro. Not gonna lie to you. Oh, next thing as well is that you know, Weeping Willow is not a cheap map to go to, it's really expensive. The mix you need. 
debates depending on what bait you're going with could be boilies those things are really expensive so you have to put in a lot of cash in it to be getting back something good out of it blue crab island now you don't really have to do that to be honest you don't need anything special to fish here you come here with your live minnows uh large minnows small small minnows can use as well depends on the fish you're going for shiners you know which are quite affordable you come here with those baits man you're good to go you know there's no special mix or anything do you want a unique tarpon mark from the spot of fish right now depends on where you are man if you buy the docks I don't really fish there If you're not at docks right now, you should be by the mangroves fishing. But as I said though, those are my picks though. You know, that, that's what I'm going with though. Come on. Oh, ho, ho, ho. that was a massive permit. Hey, this they take a while to get over though. Plus, all the time you spend uh, spotting at UK is a lot. Hell yeah! You know, uh, what's it again? 155 ounces of mix, bro? man that, that, that can take you at least a couple of minutes you know like uh, let's say two to three minutes if you have the right reel to be going in and out really fast you know hey Tony you can send over the marker bro you can send it over I don't get me wrong no chat I'm not discriminating the, the map I'm just showing you guys the difference with both of them you know both are good and I'm saying both are like competitors of what players should be grinding and what fish they should be catching you know they're both upsides and downsides to both of these maps Blue Crab Island, the action is immediate. So I, I might be understand what you're saying, and I might be thinking of the wrong way. So w when you say immediate, I'm thinking like once those mattress beep, it's an instant take, right? Like once it beep, it's a fish on. Either you're talking that way, or you're just saying that the bites like you know are that good here. So you know let me let me know what way you're thinking about it if I'm saying it the wrong way. 100 percent the every map has its pro and cons. Definitely. Yeah, but sometimes you try at well sometimes I try to explain things and uh let's just say I'm not the best with explaining stuff, so players might be misinterpreting what I'm trying to say, you know. So I'm just hoping that you guys do understand what I'm trying to say right now. I'm not the best when it comes on to explaining stuff, you know. And yes, you fill your you fill your your backpack way faster at Weeping Willow. As I said, more uniques there. 
right but you have to use the right mix you can do the same thing here however though you won't be getting all unix every day unix trophies small common because you know you got tons of other fish in the area it's not one type of fish and they all go for the same thing you know they all go for different things so everything got a heat bro and that's going to give a different diversity of fish to bite And that's a catfish bro 100 percent that's a catfish i just mean you don't have to spot for 10 minutes before you start fishing <laughs> facts bro facts you know what i also like more about blue crab island in the meantime while you're fishing with live baits i can do lower fishing at the same time you know, I don't want to be there standing forever, waiting for like, not forever, but you know, waiting while the bays are being eaten by carbs. I can be here, you know, trying to lower, moving around, you know, get fish when I need them. I'm a player where I like to be moving while fishing. I don't like to be here standing watching these rods to be going off, you know. I'd like to be doing something in the meantime. And here at Blue Crab Island, you have the options to haul that. You know. At the end of the day, it comes down to what level you are, what you prefer to catch, and where you prefer to go fishing. You know. Oh, we all have a choice. All of us. Wait, how long have I been fishing here? One hour for this one day, bro. Really? I didn't think this day was such a long day, bro. Crazy. I guess you can fish beforehand, but the big unix won't be there until you spot properly. I love the way you say that, bro. Properly. You have to properly make the mix, have the right amount, spot in the right area, and use everything correctly. You have to be precise and accurate. You have to. Here, you just need 30 centimeters, not 30 centimeters, inches. You live baits, small minnows, shiners, large minnows, and you go fishing. You don't need to be nothing like, you know, accurate or precise. And there you go, fish on. You know, but weeping willow though is like, how can I say this? It's like a mathematics class, bro. If you're not right with your formula, you're done for. Everything's going to be wrong, you know? Or it's just going to be unbalanced for you. Let's put it that way. <laughs> hey, man, it's crazy, bro. I have a unique tarpon on. Get him in, bro. Hey, Tony, again, bro? Why are you not streaming? You know? What's, what's holding you back? If it's something you don't want to say in stream, don't say it, you know? Okay, another day. Oh, this day. Let's not go to the, to the end of the peak time so we have less time to fish. Not a, not a bunch of cash or XP. But that's because, you know, I didn't catch tons of Unix that day. But we're not here to grind XP. We're here to grind these tarpons, you know. I think at Weeping Willow, uh, let's just give a rough rough estimate 1300 plus pounds of fish giving me at least 40,000 XP and around um, same for the cash if not mistaken but that's 1300 pounds of fish you know 
here you can make it the thing is though you have to get those units to bite the black drums red ones tarpons snook permits bonefish you know you gotta be getting those to make that amount of xp if you don't then you will be making it 100 percent and not every day here the fish unique size is going to be biting unlike weeping willow the best day is sunny day and there is only one sunny day there that's make it way easier to fish there is it my bad that make it way easier to fish there as well you know way easier it's not like here where you got a sunny day rainy partly sunny you know you got different days to choose from yep your mix better be in point you care you will lose money facts bro The weirdest thing is players think permits are bad in the game, but I've caught permits here. 60 pounders, that's giving me more more XP than a unicarp. Way more. Surprisingly, you know, a fish that most players don't like. Permits. If you get some decent sized ones. You'll be impressed with the XP that they're giving you. Not gonna lie to you. You have never caught a 500 pound bluegill though. I'm not sure where you catch that bluegill, but that's not on planet Earth, man. That's somewhere else, you know. Or whatever they're feeding it should be illegal let me just put it that way there you go what's this snook most likely right i feel the pigs you might as well jump in the water too, Didi. Not gonna lie to you. <laughs> yeah. Hey, don't take it the wrong way now, man. I'm just making a joke, you know. Don't take it the wrong way, man. <laughs> Wait. Wasn't this like a snook, bro? Imagine if it wasn't taking this much feet of flying, you know. Wait, how much cash is that? How do Nah, 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 nah. Whatever that's, whatever is in that pig, bro. As I said, should be illegal, man. Bottom snipers. I mean, every chaser is my bad. I mean, he got the right equipments to be honest, you know. However, though, I noticed that he's fishing with the Makonzes. So you might have bought the, the Congo pack and wasted it, bro. That's bad. Darn it, trophy. I think he bought the, the Congo pack and, uh,. You know, maybe didn't have much time to fish there, or you just wasted it. Oh, my light wasn't wasn't turned on.
Wait, can I check his profile? I think I should be able to. Wait a minute. So he bought Bolivia, Congo, and something else. Yeah, this guy been spending cash but wasting it. Uh, let me see something, bro. Got a nice permit out there, though. Nice one. Let's do some research in the meantime. Okay, that's a DLC rod right there. Now, the first which is from the Congo. Trap de la Casador, which is from Bolivia. So, he basically buy all those pack and wasted it, bro. Poor guy, man. How can I go over to the fish? Even the Amazonian maze. Yeah, how many DLC pack this guy bought and he's just rank 50? Crazy. This player might be the only player I've seen buy so many DLC packs and waste it, bro. So, Congo, Bolivia. Uh, You got the catfish right here, catfish to right. Yep. Damn, bro. How? How is that possible, by the way? Like, how can you buy some in this season and not be max level? Hey, man. Not judging, bro. Just saying that. You know, I kind of feel bad that you wasted all the cash, bro. And not making it. And I'm pretty sure those days are 30 days each. Got a 133D. Wait. I think Tony might be fighting a unique right now. What's this? Drum? Could be. Big ass permit. 10 minutes ago. Wait, how did I miss it? I'm not gonna lie y'all, but the rods he's using right now are not the best to be grinding with right now, at this map. You shouldn't be grinding with the Makonze, the La Casadores, you shouldn't be grinding with those rods. The Evi Chasers though, those are pretty good. You know, but the 72 pound rods and the 86, not the best combination to be fishing your with. Okay, I want you all to pay good ten good attention to this fish right here. So a eighty five pound to ninety carp would be giving me like three thousand XP, right? Look how many XP I'm getting for this permit right here. I want you all to pay attention to this right this right here. Yo Arthur, what's good man? You hopped in too late man, what's good? Look, so this is a 60 pound unit, right? And I'm getting 3,400 XP. But a 85 to 90 pound carp, a tweeping willow, is giving you the same, which is 20 pounds under that unit there. I caught a, what, a 70 pound permit here, and that's giving me 6,000 XP. Crazy. He said 10 minutes ago, where is that uni? 
Oh, he, he did, he did. He did. There it is. <clears throat> this should be a unique right here if I'm not mistaken. Yo Josh, welcome to the stream man. How do y'all? Yes sir. How's how you been doing man? Yeah, I think this should be a unique right there, y'all. Nice beluga, Tony. Surprisingly, I'm the only one who can't see the, the beluga on the leaderboard for him. Surprisingly. But I know it should be updated, though. Yo, where is this push going, bro? Back and forth right now. My premium has gone. So you have two options now. Is either you keep fishing without the premium, which is possible, or you can get premium for night for the next seven days or something like that and keep grinding. You know, DLCs I would not recommend it, but premium I can say that has helped me in the past before. You know, so I can vote for that one. However, though, if you're not down to grind, don't get it because you'll only be wasting the cash if you buy it, bro. Not gonna lie to you. Okay, so that's two days, two unique so far. I'm down to fish at least a few more days and to see what's gonna happen. Should be a nice one. One twenty nine pounder. I'll take it. I'll take it. Why they didn't update my my amount in the kidnet? What? Wait. Did I? I can't tell. It didn't seem to move on my screen. Yeah, what's well, going back? Welcome back, Michael. Otto is in the in, in the lobby as well, so you can ask the questions you want to ask now. Wait, did they update the? Wait, let me see something, y'all.
Okay, yes, they did, they did. For a split moment, I thought they didn't update the amount of fish we had in the in the the cube net, but they did. Life is a beautiful thing. It sure is. <laughs> I wonder why you say that, bro. Curious, you know. So the biggest unique today is 133 pound tarpon from Tony and I'm just happy he's here fishing with us as well to actually you know give me some more insight and in, uh, how many uniques are biting and if they are so far it's pretty good Oh, it might be a catfish right there. Mm, no, I don't think so. Hey, Russell, welcome to the stream, man. How was your day so far? So auto, if you're if you're like hot, oh yeah, you know it's like it's basically summer right now, and you know that's just the climate, bro. I think the summer is gonna be a hot one. Like the how it's been hot, but this one might be the hottest one we have so far. You know? Yeah, that's going off 100%. Just got off work. What's next, you know? So Otto, if you're not familiar with what's going on, Michael been fishing the Falcon Lake, right? For two weeks or so. He said he's not been making any profit. Uh, no unique star trophy has been biting that much for him. And the rocks I showed you that you're grinding at the moment right now, it's not working for him. So, you know, I'm not sure what's going on. But uh, that's totally the opposite on what's happening on your hand, you know. Now it's raining, dogs freaking out. Yeah, I think I think some rain would be really nice. Cool on the temperature, you know, like I think the rain would be really nice in this moment right now. It's a hot day, you need something to to cool down the temperature, man. Drop the, the degrees a little bit, you know. They might be celebrating for the rain because the day, the day being so hot, it's like the rain is a blessing right now for them, you know. <laughs> nice one. Oh, hell no. Nah. What? I said hell no one. They, 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 oh my God, bro. Hope y'all didn't think I said anything bad, you know. Wait, 142? But on my on my game is the biggest is 159. Wait, what? Wait, wait, let me let me go check something. So maybe that's why I haven't been seeing the fish, Tony. 
Someone caught it 159. Damn, how many players are going after these oversized um, sturgeons right now? Crazy. Earlier it was showing me 159. Now they removed it. I swear it was 159. Or maybe it was a different fish, maybe. But they still haven't updated my leaderboard as yet for me, Tony. Still not there, bro. Not sure why. I wonder if like it's it's like a, a server thing, you know? Could be. Now it's sticky and I need a beer. Oh damn, bro. I feel you, man. I feel you. But hey, the good thing is, you're off from work. You know, you have it. You have some time to yourself. So you know, just do what you can do. And you know, enjoy the rest of the day. Definitely. I'm so happy that I didn't, I didn't have to spend so many hours fishing this day right here. You know? I just want to fish the days and move on. Just grind the uniques and move on to the next day. Hey yo, Eric. Welcome to the stream, man. So Michael auto plays on PlayStation, so you can't friend him on PlayStation because you're on Xbox, you know? You gonna fish now? Cheers! Yes sir, where are you gonna be fishing right now? What map? Wait a minute, let me see something. Okay, we good, we good. I thought I was using the the wrong bait for the drums. I don't think DD's there. You know, I think he's out by now. You know, seeing Tony passing by like that. I wish you could do rotations for the tarpon, man. Like, you know, you, you got so many skin fish on this map for tarpons. I wish you could be just farming them from one spot to the next spot. That would be just, you know, insane. Falcon Lake to finish the day. Yes, sir. That's my map right there, man. Your D life from level 1 to 80 for every level. Again, I will get 1.5k cash right. Yeah, once you, you rank up or level up, you can get free cash and um, free big coins. Should be around the same cash, I'm not sure. But I know the Bitcoin should be one. Is that new? Wait. Is what new? What's going on? Okay, so you got that same thing here as well, right? Where the fish take up the bait, run with it, and then spit it right after. Lovely. You see it too.
I was not expecting that thing to be here, bro. I wasn't expecting it. Hey, Russell, question for you. Since you've been fishing in Falcon Lake, uh, what, what are your thoughts on that map, you know? I would like to know, what do you think about it so far? Hmm, what's this one? Wow, that's the fastest I've ever lost a fish on match rod. The fastest. What are the tags like numbers? Where? On my rank, on my name are like, where exactly? I like Falcon Lake, it's primarily trout. Gotta love that. Hell yeah. So, you know, is there any bad uh, news you have for that map or any bad experience ever fishing that map before? Your mic game is lagging bad, bro. It's been happening since like last week. Come on, 22 minutes to go, then we can move on to the next peak time. Oh, did I have a fish right there? When do I use mixing food thing, bro? You're not even close to the level to do that. You have to be 55 and higher, 55 to 60. That's when you should be using them uh, mix, bro. Unless you're going for some smaller fish like breams, tench, you might just make a quick mix and go for the unix. But honestly, you're not at the right level to go do that type of fishing, bro. Not gonna lie to you. I'm I'm just not sure what's going on on um, the Xbox they're playing Fish and Plant on. If it's like that spot there is bad for you, it could be, but I can't say for sure, man. For level 80, the XP isn't the best. I went there to catch everything a couple of weeks ago. Still solid, but great for lower levels. Exactly. So the thing is, Eric. Uh. Michael is the only person who is having a bad time fishing there. And I'm not sure what's going on. But, uh, you know, in my opinion, anywhere from level 15 to maybe like 30, Falcon Lake is like the top map for me to grind. That's where I've been grinding. And it's always been good, bro. Even until this day, it's pretty good. But for some reason, I recommend it to Michael and he's like, you know, he has some bad things to say about the map, bro. So, I'm not sure what's going on. <laughs> exactly what I told him, bro. Spoons and spinners. Exactly what I told him. Small minnows, shiners, you know, it, does, it doesn't have the large minnows as yet, so you can't use those. Exactly what I told him, bro, but it seems to not work for him. I don't know. 
I even went there and stream. I showed him how good it is, and uh, still, that wasn't like something was just off, you know. Yep, spawn site mayflies. I told him all them baits, man. What time do we have here? Oh. Come on, come on. Uh, I think he dropped it. Still trying to. What's up with white moose? Can you describe to me a bit? I want to know what fish there, what rods I should use. Why moves he got lake trouts from 45 to 50 pounds there. Of course he got 30 and 20 pounders which are trophies. He got splake, he got pikes, barbots, salmon, trout, rod size bro. You're going to be needing bottom snipers uh brutal smash rod you're gonna be needing 35 pound equipment there bro and you're nowhere close to that area nowhere i like white moose but don't go there because you have big net and really nice rods in real you know that's the thing eric i've been telling michael not to rush the game you know I've been trying to tell him not to rush the game because he's nowhere close to the level of grinding that map. Nowhere. But you know, he's, he's being curious. And sometimes curiosity is going to get him to go there when he shouldn't be there and he's going to be wasting whatever time he spent there fishing. It's going to be all uh, chaos there. Breaking equipment, losing the fish, not earning anything. I hate kit nuts so expensive and not even 10 pounds single fish. Bro, that's because you're not leveling up, bro. If you're not playing the game to level up, you're not going to be getting the good equipment. You won't be getting them. Wait, is Tony still fishing here? Okay, he is. He might be doing some uh, practice run for some tournament or something, you know? Could be. Mara's recommendation so most players might not be going for the rods i choose but i choose the 35 pound um every snipe bottom snipers and um brutal smash rod reason for that is that way the other maps i'll be going to i don't have to buy other equipment to fish there so the ones i have recently can go to other maps and fish as well i don't like to be spending cash on different rods every time I go to a new map you know I want the equipment I have to be able to fish the others when I do rank up that's just me
My bad, my bad. I was saying though, the next runner up uh, map you should be fishing is Everglades, but you need way bigger equipment to fish there. Way bigger. Those things are not easy fighters over there. Buy all the bait before you go there. It's cheaper that way. Also buy your day days beforehand. Yeah, so what are you saying Michael? Like you know if you buy anything on the map while there it's way more expensive, right? So before you go there, get everything ready at your home storage or your home area and then go fishing. If you you don't get what is is he saying, you know? What level is Michigan? I think Michigan is around thirty. Thirty something or thirty, I think. Level thirty. Should be around that uh level. I usually go two levels past the lake, so strongest version available rods, real, line, or accessible, if you go at the exact level. Lake is accessible, you won't have strongest version available yet. Facts, bro. Like, you know, I think the holiday, my friend, I was helping him fishing, right? He said whenever he ranks up, he always buy the, the equipment they give him. So the moment he ranks up to a different level, whatever rod and reel they give him, same time he go, he go to buy them. I told him not to do that, bro. That way you're going to be spending cash too much. And in a few minutes or so, you can be leveling up to another level, which is giving you better equipment. You know, so don't be rushing the game like that, bro. But hey, I can be here all day telling someone not to rush the game. And they go ahead and do the same thing. You know? So, I can only guide you the right way. But once you take the, right, the wrong path, that like, you know, it's all you right there. I tried, you know. It says I've save having to buy new setup every two levels. Facts, bro. And as I said to Michael earlier, I buy equipment that will also help me on other maps when I do unlock them. So for example, right? I've been to Michigan. I got my heavy chain, my bottom snipers, and my match rod. Those things can also fish at Samakin Delta. In Alaska, however though, you have to know what fish to go for on them. You know, I buy equipments that can also help me in the meantime while trying to get the, 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 the better ones, you know. Pant pass allows to allow you to go to a higher map before you reach level requirement.
and also like you know sometimes they don't give you the right stuff to use I'm not gonna lie to you sometimes they don't in fishing plant I do think you have to have the understanding of how things work you definitely have to have the understanding how things work here imagine going to Amazon in maze number 30 okay that's not possible that's not impossible because everyone's been using the tri rod you know which is easy however though you will not have the keep net to keep any of those fish you're going to mainly be keeping 200 pounders and um small trophies you know you won't be making much cash but you will be getting levels if you grind there so you know there's an upside and a downside of everything in this game bro Okay, this is day three. Uh, we're looking for a unique right here. We might not be able to get one because the day might be not the best. The reason why I said that, this day is sunny. It's good. However, though, the morning part of this peak time from 6, from 5 a.m. to 7 a.m. is the better peak time to fish. But since I don't want to spend hours of waiting to skip days, I go to the evening. Which is okay as well. So there might be either no uniques on this day for the tarpon. Or it's going to be taking way longer to get one. But let's find out man. Hey Michael, it's good to be curious bro. And to think ahead of you. But sometimes you do that to get way ahead of yourself and just jump the gun. Which, in this case, don't do it, bro. If you're thinking about it, talk to someone before you do it, you know. Get their advice, their opinion, and then you can make your decision after. And make sure that you're fishing the right day. Come on. As well. At Falcon Lake, bro. There is this day where it's one in the morning, one in the evening. Two umps. Don't fish those days, bro. Fish the, I think it's cloudy or sunny day. It's like a big, one big ump from 12 to like 5 p.m. in the evening. That's the best day to fish right there. Watch this, watch this, y'all. <laughs> you said the same thing to me earlier when I got my uh unique catfish bro. I got two fish left to complete gent. I need a unique flounder and a common pike. So the common pike I would go for like a small minnow, match rods by the the bushes or the, the reeds. And flounder, I'll go with shrimp, crayfish cut, or even um, small cut bait on, you know, feeders or match rods, and it should be good. However, though, if it's a unique, then it might take a longer while for you to get it, you know. But I know the pikes are pretty easy to get there. I've been there recently, and uh, they do go for the small minnows, man. I master him here. <laughs> Welcome to the stream, my apprentice. Hope you're doing good, you know. Hope everything is going good. And if they're not, bro, just keep going, you know.
You said, really? Hey, that's just how it is, Tony. I just need the right timing. I got the baits. Yeah. When did I get mines? I can't tell you because I haven't fished that map. Really? I just been there for the three catfish challenge, was it? No, the missions. The exploration missions, and that's it. Yeah. I would say just just try the peak times, you know? Early morning for pikes. In the meantime, you go for the flounders. If nothing bites, then you go to the late evening. You know, just try them and see. It's going to cost you, but hey, that won't be a problem to you, you know? That's all I'm here there for. The accomplishment. I hate the map. Facts, bro. I do have that map to finish up the re catfish challenge and honestly, I'm not thinking of going there. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I'm not thinking of going there, man. They should overhaul it and allow kayaks. I mean, it is a big map, you know? If you have that big cargo ship passing by, you know, at least have the option for us to be there as well with our boats if it comes down to it. However though, some might say it's too dangerous to go boat fishing because of the boat passing by. I don't know. It all depends on what they think or what it is like in real life. If it's allowed to go kayak fishing there or boat fishing. But I can see that being a possibility though, definitely. I put another spawn point across the, ma the river. Yeah, there's only two spots there to fish, right? Two spawn areas, which is crazy. Such a big map, and there's only two spots you can actually go to, to fish. Hey man, I, I say this almost every time I play Fish on Planet. There's so much room for improvement in this game. So much room. But hey, if they're not doing it, we can only think of it, you know? This game is a great game, but it can become even more greater if they put the time in it, bro. This game could be going on for years, more than what it's been there for. And you can walk from one to the other, spawn point. Yeah, that's not a thing you can't do as well, right? Yo, D, can I repeat what you said? Best peak time to fish? I didn't listen. Okay. So if you open your map, right, there should be a peak with two peaks, one in the morning, one in the evening. Do not fish that one. It's, it's either going to be the sunny or the cloudy day to fish there. And it, uh, the looks of that map is one big hump from 12 to 5 p.m. So there is no fall off until that point you know there's no in between it's just one big hump for the peak time to fish got to go see you later good luck okay for thank you for watching bro thank you for stopping by you know hope i see you next one man Take it easy, bro.
Yo, I can't believe I've been here for three days. Oh, it's just one hour, 57 minutes I've been here streaming for. Crazy. <clears throat> Why does it feel way longer than that, though? So, like, from 12 p.m. to 5 p.m. fishing, sunny, cold weather? Exactly, bro. I wish you were on PlayStation so I could see what you're doing, you know? Give you more tips, better up that way, but we have different platforms. And I'm not sure how it is. Oh. Oh, big ass head just heading in the water, bro. Just zooming right in, you know? <laughs> yeah, imagine if someone was in the way of that fish right there and he's just sailing straight towards them. Which fish is it? Was it is it a GT that used their head to hit fish and stun them? Which can be really lethal to divers too. I think it's a GT bro. They use their head to ram praise and stun them. I'm, I'm not sure the permits are the same thing. But they should be. I'm not sure though. As I said, Michael, if I have time, yes, but most times I'm really busy, bro. If I'm not here playing fish and plant, making guides, I'm doing something else like, you know, personal stuff, maybe doing a different stream. So I'm always busy, bro. Always. So I can't give you one day I will be available or not. You can just ask though. You can message me on Discord and say, yo, do you have time? And if I have time, I will say yes or no. You know, surprisingly, I've been here all day and I've not gone for flounders. One of my favorite fish to catch here. Yeah, I don't think this day we're going to get the unique to bite, y'all. We got 34 minutes remaining of the peak time. And uh, let's just say that, you know, that's not much time. Unless I'm not lucky to get one. So far, it's two days, two uniques. So it's two for three days right now. <laughs> What's this man? <laughs> he caught the rock and it's a nice one. <laughs> Crazy. <clears throat> Did he go over by the other spot? Uh what spot is that one? You got one by the barge over there. <laughs> you got one right there. You got one by my right over there again, uh, and a few more. So you have to, you know, let me know what spot you're talking, then I might have a better idea. By the barge? No, I haven't been there today. You think I should go there? Okay, tell you what, next peak time, I'll go there. Since this one is almost over, you know. I mean, we got 30 minutes to be honest, so something might be going off here soon. What work do I do? At the moment, bro, I'm not working, man. I'm not gonna lie to you. 
and that's why I'm using this time I have to do all the streams I can do because once I start working again I might not be around that much to be making videos or streaming that much you know so hopefully whenever the new maps are here I do have time to make guides and stream because hey man I can't say yeah what's going on Michael oh I never had a drum taking this much drag before on a Makanzi I've got a joke let's hear it man hey chat will this be a new personal best right here I can't say that's a tarpon now the thing is I'm using um large cut bait right so the tarpons won't be going for it I think it's one of the two drums red or black drum gotta be one of them but the thing is I've never seen one taking me that far out you know 88 pounds really oh hell no hey man crazy hey guys you saw how many drag that thing was taking right I thought it was gonna be like a hundred pounder it's been a while since I got one that big okay so I will say a word and you will repeat it Ooh, for example I say fish and you say fish food hey man I like where that's going man you never know what's gonna be the end of that uh, joke right there keep in mind bro this is YouTube you know it's really strict you have to be careful of what you've been what you've been saying and what you're going to be saying you know it's not twitch man you gotta be careful of what you're doing what you're saying and stuff like that here definitely yeah I, I, I kind of see that bro so I'm not gonna really say I'm gonna play it you know I, I don't I don't want to fall for the trick right now I don't want to do that bro Bro, look how many fish we have in the cute net. Six, six, six. Oh, hell nah. Hey, guys, can you see that? Look. There you go. We're not, we're not ending the day with that, bro. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so that joke right there. How, how did it go again? I think I, I made a video and someone said he said these what sir right like he's asking a question he said these what like I was thinking of him asking what do you mean as in my name so I said that's my name right and he said no these nuts I was like come on bro I was not expecting that. I thought it was asking a question like, what does these mean? But it wasn't like that. It said these nuts, you know, I was like, come on, man. He got me, bro. I was not thinking that way. But he got me that day, bro. Ah, right, Michael, give it a shot, bro. If you do anything wrong, you might not be able to, to, to watch my live streams anymore, bro. If you do anything that's not good, bro, you're going to be in for some, some reckoning, man. Just wait. Do with me, I say Hawaii. Now you say who? Okay, who? Let's see. Let's see what this is gonna be, bro. <clears throat> K 
catfish? Oh my god, bro. Hopefully Tony doesn't see that. Ooh. Come on, please don't let Tony see that fish, bro. Oh, I had a fish right there. Oh, Tati might have to say who had the hand of it. Okay, Hawaii who? Let's see, man. Let's see, bro. As to worry, man. If this is something I'm not expecting. I'm good, or are you? <laughs> I, I thought you were going to be like, you know, something I was expecting, man. You had to get it, bro. to get it. <clears throat> the thing is, man, you, you can fall for so many traps while streaming. It's unbelievable, you know, like, so many things you can fall for. It's crazy. So I was like, you know... I was skeptic, I was cautious to know what it was, and I wasn't known for it, man. You had to get it, bro. Okay, let's change spot since the guys want to see somewhere else, you know. The thing is, though, I don't know this spot that barge is okay to fish. I know the better spots to fish as well. I need to delete some markers, bro. I got two, oh, two many players a year, too. Mm, ah, well, we can make space, right? Is that Axel? A X L E. I think that's Axel, right? Yeah, I think we'll go right there. Yeah, I did answer you, bro. You didn't hear me earlier when I said it? I did say it. Got a laugh in the bit day. And Mineric, I appreciate you stopping by, you know, sticking around, sharing some thoughts with us, and just, you know, enjoying the day. So, hey, man, thank you for doing that. And uh, hopefully, I'll see you around in the next streams, you know. So, stay safe out there, bro. And stop by whenever you can again. Yeah, as I said, Michael, I'm not working at the moment right now, you know. So for the time being, I'll be doing this. However, though, at some point, I will not be able to be around that much, making videos, doing streams. So I'm doing the best I can right now with the time I have, you know. Wait, is he hook up on the fish? He is. Big ass permit, bro. <laughs> 67 pounds. Okay, that's the biggest one today so far. You know, some players might think permits are annoying. I do think that sometimes. But if you get in the trophies and Unix, bro, it's like you, you're good to go. XP cash wise, it's good to go, you know? I wouldn't say for the, I would say, I wouldn't say for that, uh, Eric, it's more like, you know, the views, bro.
the followers not not I wouldn't say that more like for the the views and the like sometimes it comes down to that so yeah hey guys I'm not gonna lie to you I don't think we should be talking about this topic right here might be some consequences to it I'm still learning all those um, things so let's just not talk about that topic because I don't want to be getting into any trouble man you know if you guys talk about I might not be able to respond to you guys with any answer just know YouTube is a funny thing bro as I say you gotta be careful of what you're saying what you're asking and stuff like that you know and at any moment anything can go wrong so let's just enjoy the stream talk about the stream what's going on and not get too deep in the conversation you know Wait, what right is that? Telescopic rod? Oh no, that's Magister. He's good. So you see that Michael? He's level 58, right? And he's using a tele I mean not telescopic rod, a match rod, Magister. Which is the right rod for him to use. He's not using anything overpowered because once he do that, there is no XP for him to gain. Let's see what he what he's using, what pound rod is he using one second bro 57 the same exact one i'm using right now same exact one 42 42 that's good you notice he have the he also has the the tropicana but not using it he's smart and his setups are pretty good i'm not sure about the 83 real with the 80 oh getting a bite getting a bite I think he knows what he is doing, bro. I was saying that you should throw a float by the barge, D. Okay, I'm gonna try that, bro. The thing is, I'm uh. What can I say? I'm not quite close to barge to be honest. And I don't really want to cast in front of him either. But I can I can try it. Oh that doesn't affect him. Uh yeah. I don't want to do that, bro. I want to fish there, Herrick, but you, you know, he's facing that direction, bro. You know, see? Sometimes I don't really like myself personally. I don't really like anyone to be in front of me or casting over my screen. And I would not like to do that to him, you know? Maybe we can go around him. It's so stupid in fishing plant when you play with friends and every. What's that? But passenger capacity? Oh, that's boat. Okay. Boat passenger capacity. Things are for only one person. That's dumb. Yeah, you know, you got two seats. You got behind there as well. But it's only for one person, bro. That's what you're saying. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to go around him. I think we should be good right here, right? I mean, I'll still be casting in front of him, but at least not across, you know? Put this one right here. I know the board you can catch flounders, drums, um, striped bass. Put one right there. 
and the next one should be out of his way depends on where he's going to cast down yeah I think we should be good mm, not quite but I think that's that should be good enough right What I do like though, this person right here, I think his, his equipments are pretty good. Pretty balanced the way he wants them to be, you know. The only problem with fishing with the match frogs in the boat is that you, you barely see or hear them when, they, when there's a fish on. You know, you barely. Is it worth buying something in the game for real money like 100 big coins for 10 euros? Okay, in certain situations it's good. But if you don't have to, don't do it. For example, uh, I think in the past I've bought big coins just because I've been doing a event guide and I want the big coins to get bait to do a guide. And upload a video that case I had to do it right but if you're just fishing and playing the game don't do it bro ultimate fisherman welcome to the stream man try thinking of something better premium or you know something that's gonna help you bro big coins is important but I don't think you should be spending cash on it without a good uh, reason for that, you know? Always understand what you're doing and how is it going to affect you when you get it. How can I catch more bass? Where have I been fishing? You know, I haven't been using the major popper in this place in a long time. It's been a while, man. It's been a while. Just checking. Hey, Eric, am I casting the bait in the right area at the barge? Or is it different? Should it be more out to the left? Or more to the right let me know more to the right okay I hey, ultimate fisherman uh, if you didn't hear me earlier I was asking what map you've been fishing for the bass, you know. Dutch is there. What's up, Dutch? Welcome to the stream, man. How is fishing going? So far, pretty good. You know, the Unix are biting again. You know, the last time I've been here, I think it was me, you, uh, Eric, which is RW, uh, and Keisha was fishing here with live baits, and nothing much was biting. But now, I can't say they're back, bro. No, oh, come on, come on, don't spit the bait. Oh my god, I hate that, bro. I hate that. So first it was at Congo, where the, the fish go with the bait, and then spit it right after. Come on, it's a flounder. Oh my god. Second, it was um Amazonian maze, and now it's at Blue Cup Island too. Come on, bro. It's been happening all day. Fish take the bait. They run with it and then drop it. That's where you had. Oh, we 
Yeah, I'm not sure if he's if he's there, man. And yes, Blue Cup Island, I had some great experience here fishing in the past. And up until this day, it's one map I recommend players to go fish as well. Definitely. Tons of uniques, tons of spots to fish. Even better, tons of fish to fish for. Bass, tarpons, drums, flounders. Like, come on, you know, you got so many options to go fishing for. And to even make it even better, it's a really fast paced map. You're not going to be here just sitting, not getting anything to bite, unless you don't know what you're doing. But this map is pretty good. You guys don't know the grind I put in to get to, get to this map back in the days. When they first released Blue Crab Island, I was grinding Michigan the entire time. And you guys know pikes are not for XP, but for the cash. Let me just say, man. I spent the day and night in real life grinding that place just to get there. Is it worth buying like the, the thing you wear on your chest? You talking the, the, the vest thing? Yes, it is. It's definitely worth to buy taco box on um, the vest so you can carry more equipment with you, bro. I think it's a must have in the game. It's a must have. So if you if you notice in my backpack or my inventory, it's always messy. I have tons of lowers, rod, reel. Well, I wouldn't say reel to be honest, but no rods, my bad. Lines, all that's because if, of you having a taco box and the, the vest and stuff like that, you know, you need them. I'll take it. Someone's called me. I have to take that call later. Hopefully, it's not anything crucial, you know. But what's so special about those glasses? Cheapest ones are 100 bay coins. I personally, I will not buy them. However, though, what's special about them is that they change the looks of the map. Like less sun rays in your eyes, you can more see fish clearly, and so on. But honestly, I would not spend a hundred big coins on the glasses, bro. I will not do it. You don't need it. That's one thing in the game I think players don't need, bro. Definitely not. I got some glasses. And uh, how often do you wear them, Eric? You're like, you know. <laughs> I got some too, but I don't know, man. Change the looks of the game for me, bro. Way different. I think Tony have had enough of this map so far. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, tomorrow is Saturday and I'm not sure I will be playing Fish and Plant tomorrow, man. I'm not sure where to go. I've been to basically all the bigger maps lately. Not sure where to go, what to do, you know. To be honest, this map or this stream should be yes tomorrow's stream. It should have been. But uh, I decided to do it today, man. You know? Yeah. We should be getting bites pretty soon, though. We should be able to get some bites pretty soon. Bro, I have too, many, too much question. I gotta shut up. Man, if you have question, bro, ask away, man. I mean, that's what the chat's there for, right? 
for you guys to talk, ask questions, communicate. Of course, I might not be getting an instant response same time, but when I can, I will definitely answer them. Be back in 10 minutes. Okay, Tony, uh, what? Yeah, we can, we can keep fishing on. Let's try something different. Wait, did I see that right? I only have one buzz bait remaining? Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah. This is my last buzz bait remaining, bro. What the hell? Oh, uh, hell no. Oh, come on. Don't I have it with me? I don't have it with me. The green, the green major popper. Why? That sucks. Wait, is Michael saying that he's asking too much questions but not getting the answer? I'm pretty sure I answered all of his questions, bro. I'm pretty sure of that. Okay, guys, I think uh, we have to stick with the buzz bait. We maybe change the, the secondary lowers. But I was thinking of doing a major poppers uh, lower fashion. Come on. Come on. But unfortunately, we don't have that one. Surprisingly. This is our fourth day with two unique tarpons. Level 68. It shouldn't be your fishing. It should be at um, Bolivia. Why is it your fishing? Maybe he's just taking a break, you know. Needs something else. Tired of the grind. Tired of catfish and so on, you know. Yeah, but honestly though. I don't think he'll be making much XP here, judging on his level. 68 is going to take him way more XP to level up to the Kong, I mean to the, the maze. Thanks for helping me a lot. And man, just hope you put those t uh, advice together, Michael, and make the right decisions, you know. Of course, along the way, you're going to be making wrong ones, but that's going to happen anyways. I said they look way too fast. We should be getting a bite. There you go. Oh. Big take, big take. Show yourself. Mm. Mm, not convinced it's a unique, bro. Not convinced. Yep, I don't think it's a, it's a unique. I think it's a trophy. Prove me wrong. Come on. What? But my smallest unique. Actually, no. 
I've caught it under 100 pounds unique before. Under. Definitely. Well, that's three uniques for four days now. You know, if players can go on and fish this place once again and get these uniques to bite, no matter the size, they should be good, bro. With the unique tarpon, with the permits, drums, snooks, they can do some crazy grind here. Definitely. I think it's a flounder right there. Yes, sir. I wish you could see these fish way better, but you can't. Even if you go first person, no, third person, my bad. It's not quite showing you the fish. Oh, okay. I'm still waiting for this one to go crazy. I think it might not be in the right depth though, like, you know, since I'm using 30 inches for top water fish, not really top water, but you know, fish that are not far down feeding. Maybe that's why, I'm not sure. There you go. So Michael, are you heading out right now? You calling today? What's the word, man? I think I might change one of these match rods for another flounder for a uh, bottom rod. Get some drums, you know. I think Tony's on the break, Dutch. Oh my god, bro. You didn't see, you guys didn't see that, okay? No, I didn't want to do that, bro. Come on. I'm turning in 360 right now. Crazy. Oh, there was a tarpon right there. Let me do something. Maybe changing the bait in that area where the barge will give us the bite we need. Nope, not large minnows. You know, I do think the scale sardines in the game are one of the better baits to fish with. However though, I don't really use it anywhere else but this map. But I'm pretty sure if you fish other maps with this bait, I think it can be pretty good there, you know. I think maybe in Amazonian maze it could be a really good bait there. Uh, maybe Bolivia, maybe even at the Congo, judging by the fish that's there. However, though I do think scale sardines are like salt water baits, you know. I do think so. Yeah, get some drums in the net. Oh yeah. So our biggest unit today is a 129 pounder. Which is not bad, you know. For you to get 150s and 140s, you have to be 
lucky enough to get them that big. But I'm just here to see if they're biting. And so far they are, you know. So I can once I can once more recommend this map to players. But then when I when I think of recommending it, I would recommend players to go for drums over tarpons because they weren't biting man. But now I can say that they're here and uh you know just go for them. I think next time I come here, I will go with the, the Ever Chasers. That way, I won't be losing much XP. And, uh, you know, if anyone asks for recommended rods to use here, that's the biggest bottom rod I recommend fishing your wits. Definitely. My bad, I have some stuff to take care of. No, oh, you good, bro. All good. Welcome back, Tony. I think your spot is taking over, though. Oh, we got four players here. I think it's been a couple of months, maybe a year now, since I've caught two Unix in one day for the tarpon. That might be pushing it, but it can definitely happen. I swear I saw something down there. Okay, I think we might have to move back to the mangrove since we caught a few Unix here. Permit, drums, tarpon. The other Unix is going to be at the mangroves, you know. So might as well go back there. Oh. Oh, uh, I, didn't, I didn't strike, bro. Come on, game. I barely moved the rod. And they said I striked. How? Even though I've been going to the mangroves most of today, it's not the only spot to fish. It's just the spot I can use all the rods there and just, you know, enjoy it there more. In the meantime, while waiting for the, the tarpons to bite, I could be there fishing for something else in the meantime, you know. Oh, the tide is too high. Oh, come on, bro. Wait, 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 wait. What? There you go. I had to spam the X button to place on that rod, bro. I had to. Hey, that's crazy. This guy is over 76 and he's fishing here. He should be at the, the Congo right now. What's going on? Hey man. Sometimes you just need something else to go for, you know? Something different. Maybe he's trying to fish the maps that he skipped over. Possibility, you know? That's where the topic comes in where, you know, 
you skip to the better map but not enjoying the game while playing it because you skipped over so many maps and not experiencing what the game is like to fish those areas you know so now he's going from big to small not from small to big not really enjoyable going from big to small fish it's like you're downgrading and not upgrading you know but hey man you choose a path so you have to walk it you know oh you see what he's using oh hell yeah Tropicana bro that's my rod right there. Okay, I think we can fish at least two more days and then we can take a break. I need to have enough uh, days to fish on this map for this stream to actually say that yes, it's guaranteed units are back, you know. My bad. Was oh, this a trophy? Yeah, I think it does. Or maybe not. <laughs> really small fish. The good thing is we didn't lose any XP for it. 36 pounder. And that's no XP lost on that fish. Using the right gears, man, you don't have to worry, you know? The thing is, at level, I think, 55, it's really hard to find a... Let's see spinning our casting rod to use here to get the right XP for it but I would say the the sharp caster or the the rod they give you with the Peru map there's a pretty good spinning rod there I barely use it but I do have it I think it's one of the best looking reels in the game as well in the rod I don't think I have it on this account though. It's on my main one. Ah, oh, come on, Snook. I know I, I could just tell he was gonna go for it. Oh, he dropped it. Crazy fish. So at the moment, y'all, I don't think we're going to be able to get another unique because I already got one for this day. So I'm just waiting for this day to pass over. Let's skip to the next one. Yeah, everything down for the XP right there. Every single thing. A 88 pound rod and reel catching a 44 pound fish. Like, you see the difference between the pounds right there, you know? Really, a lot of them. I wish one of these days we can get double tarpons in unique size to bite. That'd be a great way 
to end the stream on. Double O Cups, Unix. Crazy, man. I don't think I've ever done it on stream before, but I've done it a lot offline. Come on. Snook maybe? No, I don't think the Snooks will go for this Kira Sardine though. I don't think they will. No matter what I'm streaming for any day, what I'm fishing for, I'm always trying to get my backpack, oh my bad, my key net, to have the most amount of fish in it by the end of the peak time. A level 2 guy just joined us. Level 2. What the hell? Let's do some research. Are we getting the fish to bite? No, I don't want to do private chat with him, bro. Want to see his equipment he have here? Level two. Oh, fish on, baby. I'm thinking he's fried. He's chalked. I don't think he's ready to fish here, but let's see what gears he have, you know, I'm really curious to see what, what he have. Hmm, we get in the bites though, so we can't check him out as yet. Okay, there we go. You profile. 10.5 pound Liberty cast with a 70.5 pound reel. <laughs> Yo, what? Yo, it, it, oh my God, bro. He plays the wrong reel on the wrong rods, man. Bro, I want to help this kid, bro. Not gonna lie to you. He's not gonna have the best time you're fishing, bro. Uh, you know, he didn't hug my help, but I'm, I'm just gonna say something, bro. <clears throat> <clears throat> he might respond, he might not. King master forever. Okay, I hope he does see that message, bro. Because whatever fish you're gonna catch, bro, is gonna break him off instantly. Whatever fish. Okay, that's that's what I need right there. To match rod. Wait, is that him out there? Nope, that's not him. I know it's some, none of my business to be, you know, searching up anyone's profile, but it's in the game and I'm curious to see what they're using, bro. Okay, 
okay no response well I tried this might be the only fish that might not uh, rip his bait off if it comes down to it this catfish right here might be the only fish he can get and uh, get away with not losing anything yeah how many days do you have for the DLC pack here not sure permit come on I want to see what his first fish is going to be like when you get one here. And what's going to happen? Was it a tarpon or a permit? I can't tell. No responses yet either. I'm going to say to him in this one. You might not be familiar with the private messages as yet either. You literally start playing the game unless he's on an alternate uh, account. You know, that's the only way he's going to be fishing this map and uh, know what is he do know what he's doing. You know, other than that, I don't really think he is though. I think he's a brand new player. Hey, that's a unique key oven right now. That's a pretty unique right there. Yep. Pretty nice one. One of the best actually feeling to have in the game is to see the fish exposed out of the water while you're trying to get him in. Mostly up into drums or the permits. And I think that's about it to be honest. The snooks maybe. I don't think this is a unit right here. Don't you dare spit the bait, bro. Don't you do it. This rod right here I'm using. I mainly use it for sharks and uh, tiger fish. So of course the XP will not be the best. But it's not a big rod where a 80 pound tarpon will give you less XP. This is actually a good rod to fish your with. It's not bad. Hey chat, y'all think this is my second unique for the day right here? Or is it not? I can't say, I don't think it is though. But I've been saying that all day. And yes, it's a unique. But it's a really small one, you know? So I can't really say if it's a unique or not.
trophy definitely unique size i don't think it is yeah see it was fighting like a unique but it wasn't one did he respond okay well man i can't help you anymore i tried to help you but didn't want it so it's whatever Yo, Eero, what's good, bro? Welcome to the stream, man. If I honestly want to pull the skill net, guys, I could definitely do it. I could grind daytime and nighttime to pull the skill net. Both peak times are good. But, hey, man, we're not going to do that, you know? We're just here to see the buy rates for the tarpons, the unique, so I can't be doing all that when that's not the plan of the stream, you know? Okay, I'm still waiting for King Master to catch a fish, bro. I'm still waiting for him to get one. Oh. Three hour stream? That's not bad. What time is it? Almost 6 p.m. Let me check something. Competition. Salt with the Giants. Oh my god. This thing was going on. And I'm on the right map fishing, but didn't realize it was. Oh, that's one thing I want to try that competition right there. What rewards are done? Who win it? Rafa? Hm. Rewards X rays deep runner, hunch runner, bullet sinker. In the slug. Mm. Not many lords I used to be honest. But anything X rays wise should be good. You just have to find the right map to fish with them. What's going on out there? Wait, I might have seen this right. Another level two guy just joined, bro. What the hell is going on, bro? Smoke Dog 65. First ever time playing Fishing Planet, and the first map is the Amazonian. I mean, the Blue Cup Island. It's time to investigate, y'all. <laughs> I'm just always curious to see what they have with them. Most likely the same thing like that guy over there. Most likely. Not a bad fish right there. Come on, come on, turn your head this way. Okay. I'm staring him away where you don't. Okay, there you go. Let's see. Oh, he left? Oh, he left. 
Unlucky guy, bro. He escaped me investigating his um what does he have? Lucky guy, man. Am I lagging? Yeah, I think Fork is online to do a competition. Most likely. You know, I'm actually enjoying today's fishing here. Not gonna lie. I'm getting the fish we came here to catch. They're biting, so you know, I'm not disappointed at all. Not one bit. Oh, he's back. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. I wonder if they are friends, bro. Possibility, you know. View profile. Okay, at least this guy know what is he know what's at least he know what he's doing, you know? At least. But he only have one rod with him. As that's a really new uh, player right here, but at least his rods are not his setup is not bad, bro. His biggest fish is a trophy blue. I mean, crappy. I think he, he got this, you know. He can do it. The other guy, I'm not sure. Oh, lobby is, is full. Oh my god, bro. It's like Call of Duty. But I got the noobs in my, my lobby, you know. The noob teammates are my 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 um my players. Level 13, level 2, and level 2. Go crazy, man. If they know what they're doing, they can rank up on this map really fast. However, though, I'm pretty sure they can't keep the bigger fish here. I'm pretty sure. Okay, we're gonna be fighting this fish for a while right here. As much as I want to take up that harder rod, it might be risky to do it, bro. Yeah, we might lose one of these fish. They're both pretty nice fish, but the one on the bottom rod might spit lower way faster. Um, see? Crazy how they just spit the bait on the bottom rod, bro. Crazy. I said lower, I mean bait. My bad. Every day you got new players playing Fish and Planet, man. Every single day. And that's good to see. 
However, though, they're not really quite informed about what they're getting into, you know. When they buy DLC packs, they're not getting the right keep not to keep fish. The baits, I don't think the baits are pretty good. Keep not wise, that's bad. I don't think there's a DLC pack that give you well let me rephrase that. For the bigger maps, I don't think there are keep nuts there that I can keep the max big fish there. Maybe small maps, yeah, you're good to go. But the bigger maps, I don't think you have a keep nut to keep the the biggest unique there on that map. Okay, two units down. Find more to go. So what is it doing? Try to get on land? Yeah, I think he's trying to do that. Nice, you got the buzz bait too. That thing can help him right there. It's a different color, but it should be good with that bait right there. The white and black buzz bait are pretty good as well. I just chose the the acid green because I think it's way better, you know. I wonder what they're giving that DLC pack, by the way. Yeah, I wasn't expecting Kane Master to be in the lobby forever, you know. One second guys, I'm gonna go check something. Boot pack. I think it's this one right here. Oh, it's on sale. Okay, I see why players are buying it then. Twenty nine which is twenty dollars right there. Free boat, well not free, you pay for it, you know. Carolina rig. Wait, are they saying that rigs here can work on Duke of Island? Wait a minute, that might be something to try out, man. Okay, got some nice um, lowers. I'll go with larvae over the slugs any day. Major popper is good. That's good to use. Buzz bait. They also got the acid green color one as well. Okay, so they have options to fish with. Okay. The real the rod is the rod is good and so is the keep net. So the total fish weight is 551 and the biggest fish you can hold in the kidneys is 220. So they can catch and keep everything with this DLC right here. No lines? Did I miss any lines by? Yeah, 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 yeah. 69 pound braid for a 70 pound rod. I mean, it's not bad, you know, it's not bad. No leaders though. I think they can do some really good fishing with this pack right here. I can see that happening. But if you want we can talk tomorrow. Off stream. 
let you know Tony as I said just message me when you can and uh, I'll get back to you as soon as possible you know Wait, you ranked up. You caught a thirty pound what was it? Twenty pound uh permit. And he ranked up twice. That's good, bro. Oh, I didn't check how many days he got with premium. I didn't see it. Hey man, let's see what tomorrow is going to be like, you know. So I'm assuming you're heading off right now. Yeah, I just want to fish at least one more day and yeah, we can call it right there, you know. Trying for a couple more uniques today, and uh, I'm a bit excited for real. Why is that, man? I think we have enough time for unique tarpon today as well. Yo, what is this guy doing, bro? Really annoying, man. Weird. Damn randoms, bro. Low level players. Always doing something crazy. <laughs> Yo, he just headbutt me, bro. You want to knock me up, bro, but that's not gonna happen. Hell no. Oh, I had a fish right there. I'm getting tons of bite today. But they're all missing though. Hey Chuck, give me one second, let me do something. <coughs> Okay, we should be good. Oh, come on, game. Stop freezing, man. Do I need to uninstall fish and plan to re reinstall it? Not sure, man. But I do that and lose everything. I'll be pissed off so bad. He got bored of fishing. No patience, man. You can't just, you know, fish and cast every time and get something to bite, you know. You have to keep at it, you know that. I think I also saw this while I was spectating my friend playing. A new player just dropped in the lobby. He made one cast and then move on. He didn't spend en enough time there to keep fishing. He just cast his rod, read it back in and move on. 
you know. Yeah, I'm waiting for something big to strike this bus bait right there. It's been really a active day for it. So I'm just waiting for that moment to happen. Still fishing? Yes, sir. What about you, Otto? What have you been up to? Just chilling. So you're not grinding today? You taking a small break? You know, I notice I've barely used this thing top water. Barely. Oh, so you did some fishing today as well. I mean, look at it this way, Otto. Even though you, you know, your way and so on, you won't be missing out on anything because uh, the premium you had it expired right so you're not wasting it because you did most of the grinding while you had it so yeah i think you're good to go man if you had premium now you know that's that's you know you uh not using it for one day but in this case you're busy so it's not like you're wasting it if you had it Come on. You're ranked, you're almost over 30 in the game, so you know. You get in there. Bigger maps, more aggressive fish, better paying fish, better XP as well. The only problem is that you don't have the right uh, rods to fish there. But in time, you can you can get it, bro. You can you can do it and get those rods to fish there. Come on, tarpon. Go crazy, man. Come on. One second, y'all. Okay, my bad, I'm back. Do you know when the update is coming out for salt water? Wait. Is that the update you're talking about, Otto? I have no idea, man. But, uh, I can say for sure it's not too far.
I think it's really close by, not gonna lie to you, bro. Most likely there's gonna be a DLC as well. So you can start saving up for it. Or you can start grinding to get there. So you know you got two choices. You can get the DLC or you can grind away to get there when it drops. If it comes down to that area. Uh, comes down to that uh, option. Dark Blade. I've got some money cards within my tours. Hell yeah. Hey man. You work for it. And you get a reward, you know. See you tomorrow. Okay, Tony, take it easy, man. But I probably won't spend it on DLC. Yeah. I mean, you know, you got so many other things to spend the cash on, bro. You know, so you never know. As I said, it might be a few months away, but I can't say when that map is going to be releasing. In that time, you have so many options to spend your cash on um, stuff, you know. <coughs> Okay, this guy that's fishing right here is smart. He got two match rods, two bottom rods. Why did he move, bro? That way he can both fish for drums and tarpons at the same time. Most players, when they fish here, it's pure bottom rods. That's it. Now another catfish, bro? Come on, man. I could get the Congo pack, but I won't. Yeah, you have to put time in to grind a place, bro. Easy XP, fast cash, but if you don't have the time to do it, you will just waste that DLC. And you have to be ranked 70 to get the best gears, or some of the best gears in the game. A good enough keep net, a strong casting rod at your level. If you get the Congo pack, you can get rods boat and stuff like that but you won't be able to keep the fish over oh uh, let's see i would say anything over 300 pounds not perch wise you can't keep it tiger fish yes you can keep all of them so you know it's recommended bro but if you don't think you can you're gonna make it to the grind don't get it bro Yo, Alan, what's good, bro? Welcome to the stream, man. That's one map I would recommend anyone to get if they can. But of course, you have to know the, the upsides and the downside of that map. When it, It's not the map, to be honest. It's the DLC, bro. You have to know exactly what you're getting yourself into before you buy the pack. Bonefish? I missed it. I just started Warzone again. And uh, how are you liking it so far? I bought it by the fast. Crazy man. Yeah, I don't really spend cash on Call of Duty. I just save 1k cut points to get the DLC. I mean, the battle pass when I, when I need it. But you got some pretty good stuff in the past this year. What modes have I been playing though? I like it and I'm just trying to get better. 
So honestly, Alan, my recommendation is to play Plunder. That way, you can train there. You don't have to worry about dying or anything like that, bro. That's what I do when I'm not streaming. Like, I go practicing in Plunder, bro. It's really good there. Ashika Island. Yeah, you're going to need some practice to, to learn that map. And stuff like that, you know. Like, I could put the Congo in summer holiday and grind. Then again, auto, maybe, just maybe. In summer, that's when the salt water map will be releasing. So, you know, you can either buy the, the salt water map over the Congo. Or, you know, it depends, bro. And Unix Day? You got tons of Unix Day. Couple tarpons, tons of permits, snook, bonefish, you know. Welcome to the stream, Richard. Hey, yo, Alan, as I said, bro. Had me on the other account, man, because that's my Call of Duty account, you know. So, that's the only way you're going to see me online over there. What are you talking about, Richard? <laughs> what are you talking about, man? When will be the next stream for Call of Duty? Honestly, it should have been today, but uh, I streamed Twitch and Plant over it, so maybe tomorrow or sometime soon, you know, weekend. But we can definitely play some Plunder offline. Maybe some Ashika Allen if it comes down to it. But you know. Sometimes I just like to chill back and not worry about sweat. I just like to go crazy and, you know, just enjoy the day. Plunder is where I go to do that, though. I got some serious Plunder um, videos to upload as well. Some serious ones, bro. I played a bit of Warzone 1. The best Call of Duty right there. Well, that I have played so far, you know. The unit doesn't seem to be biting this day, y'all. Not gonna lie. When I say unique, I'm talking about the tarpon, not the other fish, though. Approximately chat is something, bro. Yeah, I turn that thing off, man. You got players playing music, being negative, being racist, some shit like that, bro. Like, I don't want to hear all that stuff, you know? Then again, while you're communicating with your friends, the enemy on the other side can also hear you and push you that way. You know, sometimes it's fun to have present chat on, but... Sometimes it's just really bad. It's a bad idea, bro. Really bad. Yeah, I got mine turned off, man. I'm not turning that thing on. No, sir. Like... As I asked him, and this is YouTube, bro. The simplest thing can get in so, such a big problem. So you have to be just on guard, even though sometimes you're on guard and it still happens. 
Have you ever played VR? No, sir. Never, not once. But I've seen my friend play it before. Yeah, not looking too good for the Unix today. But you know, I wasn't expecting the Unix every day I fish. Because, you know, it's fishing. Not every day is going to be the same day. They look the same, but they're not. You know, so that's something you have to look out for. Don't be expecting Unix every day. And if you're expecting them, don't be expecting them to be the bigger ones, you know? It's fishing, bro. It's something you can't really predict, you know? And it's the same thing in real life as well. You might have a good run for certain days and then there's just this one day that come by where it's just not hit. Yeah, sure, first I need some dinner. Oh, that's crazy, Dutch. I might keep going for another few uh, peak times, but I won't be here for too long, man. I mean, at the same time, you can fish and um, have dinner at the same time, right? I mean, that's a lot of interruption, but it's possible. So, Alim, you playing right now or not? What is the best DLC? The Congo is the best DLC and it's down in the game. Best one. However, though, even though it was the best for me, it can be the worst for you as well. Judging because of, you know, in my time when I bought the Congo, I was in a good place where I had a pretty good keep net, pretty good rod, and bottom rod. So I did not have any problem fishing there. For a new player though, they might have a hard time fighting the fish, keeping them, and, uh, you know, moving around the map, if it comes down to it. Come on, Tarpen. Have I caught any Unix as yet? I don't think so, right? Permit. How long will you be streaming for? Because I have a bit. But I'll be back. Oh, you're saying that you're heading out for a minute? Uh, I, I can't say how long I'll be streaming for today. It's 6.30 p.m. for me. I might can go another hour or so, it depends on the way I'm feeling. But I think I'll, I'll be around for, for a few more minutes, maybe an hour. I mean, do your thing, and uh, hopefully when you're back, I'm here, you know. Come on, come on. Oh, no. 
Twitter is pretty dead. Not gonna lie. Yeah, it was in another lobby, fishing this spot, and when he moved to a new one, he just spawned where he, they left him. Oh, come on, bro, don't do that, man. Don't you see me? <coughs> it's all my fault. I'm not going to be salty about it, you know. I choose sufficient public sessions today. I could avoid everything. These randoms doing crazy stuff like this. But I chose sufficient public session today, man. Look at them, bro. Crazy. I'm pretty sure by now I should be spawning for him. Pretty sure. This man got all the way to the left to fish. Directly to the left. Straight ahead. And he chose to cast across my rods, bro. Come on, we got 30 minutes to get this unique in. <laughs> hey man, it's what it is, you know. I might move, I might stay here. And by, and by, oh no, my bad. And I have the right to say something if I wanted to. So if I get really annoyed by him being here in my way, I'm gonna say something, bro. But as I said, I'm not gonna be I'm not gonna be making a big deal out of it. Oh come on. I wish I had the major popper was with me. I wish I had them. Well, the right ones I want to use at least, you know. Oh, he's using crankbaits. You guys want to hear me? Yeah, I just checked out to see what uh, baits lower is he using. The crankbait is not the best, in my opinion here. So you might have to make at least a a hundred cast to get something really good. By the way, what rods are those? Seems like the, the majesty and something else. Can't say. Even when I tried to slow down the, the, what you call it, the lower, he still missed it. Hey 
Hey Dutch, you going after a re catfish challenge? Because I see you going after the gizzard shad, man. You trying to get the Unix or you just fishing? Okay, this is uh, I can't I can't do this anymore, bro. Not gonna lie to you. If he was fishing, actually, that's that's okay, bro. But he's just standing there, bro. What did he catch? Need that unique? Oh, he, okay. I mean, you know, you can try it. It won't be as easy, though, you know. But you should be able to get it. What's his name, bro? Let me see what what his profile looking like right now. Yeah, he's cooked. I think he have on a drum right now. On that small feeder rod, he's cooked, bro. He's done for. Either break his line or release the fish. He's cooked. Oh, yeah. Yep, he let go. Did he break his line or anything? Yeah, he released the fish. All right, wait. Nah, I don't think he, he had it on. Mm hmm. He's cooked. The only good rods he have is the Majesty and I think the casting rod. Nothing else will happen here. Nothing else. Unless you go for some gizzard shot like Dutch. <laughs> <laughs> Gives her a shot, maybe, maybe some bass. I'm not sure. But he's cooked right now. Finally, bro. Damn. I wish it was a unique though. Yeah, I'm hoping the next day, next peak time, we can get some better fish to bite. I'm hoping, fingers crossed, you know. Yeah, you can have this pot for that day right there. You can have it. But I'm definitely going back after this day. Stupid player. 
Mm, let's go there. <laughs> I tried, man. I didn't make it in time. I tried. Okay, let's make a U turn. Reset. I want us to catch at least a few uniques today before we end the stream. At least a couple of uniques, you know, doesn't matter the size. Hopefully catch some nice uniques, man. How long have we been streaming for? Four hours? Typical hours right there, you know? Normally those hours will be short stream. Come on, there you go. But my short stream never short to be honest. It's always four to six hours. Which is crazy. If I do get this unique tarpon early today, I might be able to go for some other fish. Something that's not uh, in this area. Come on, come on. Ho <laughs> ho ho. For a moment there, I thought my bobber disappeared. Couldn't see it for a minute. Oh, we had a big bite again right there, bro. Crazy. Uh oh, we got two fish on. Oh my god, we got triple, triple, triple threats. Oh, uh, this is not good, this is not good. Hey Dutch, what bait and uh, peak time been fishing for the kids or shad? Let's get this one in as well. Oh, we lost one, bro. Come on. Uh, if you guys didn't notice why I switched spot, it wasn't because of the kid that was there. It's because of the peak time. This day right here, rather right fish here at this mangrove by the barge on this peak time. Yo, yoga, man, I haven't seen in a long time, man. Welcome to the stream, bro. What have you been up to? Have I seen you since this year? 
I doubt it. I doubt it, bro. Pinkies and maggots. You can also try the blood worms too. Hey guys, do you know how hard these fish in real life is to catch? You guys will not believe me, man. These are not simple fish to catch in real life. With your bony mouths, like, you think you're upsetting them when they're just chomping down on the bait and the hook. They're just holding it. They're not upset or anything like that. They run straight towards you and just pick up bait, bro. Or they just shake their heads and then it's loose. Everything drops, you know. I sleep in live. Well, you saying you've been falling asleep while watching live streams, man? Wait a minute. Oh, something want that bit right there for sure. Come on, go for it. I think he dropped it, bro. Hey Dutch, almost there, man. Almost there. Damn, that's a close one. And another one, damn. <clears throat> That's one thing with the, the gizzard shards. You can get a couple of nice trophies, but when it comes down to the uniques, it's like you know, they bite at their own timing, which is weird. Nice fish, nice fish. Oh my god, I missed it. Really? How? Was that really too fast? That could have been a unique right there. Double strikes float. Yeah, I missed all them bites early though. I think I got one of them. I tried with a triple bite, but I missed. Oh. Okay, something seems interesting to the bait right there. Yep, it's done for. It dropped it again. No shot, bro. How? Something is right there. Come on, come on. Uh, he dropped it again, bro. Like, what's going on? They're biting, but they're not staying on, you know? Maybe it's a curious day for them. You know, they go check out the bait, take a nibble but not actually, you know, stand around to get hooked. And of course the primary stays on, right? I lost the unique tarpon, could be a trophy as well, but the, the primary stayed on, right? Lovely. So yoga, how, how, how has it been bro? Like you know, 
as I said, I haven't heard or seen you in a long time, bro. How has it been? I think I might want to recast this right right there. But it still seems to be getting action though. Busy sleeping. <laughs> Man. I was expecting that one, but I hey. If that's how it's been, then it's just what it is, you know. Yo, Cody, welcome to the stream, bro. I think once this day is 7 p.m., things should be really fired up, you know. You guys will not know the amount of strikes I missed, bro. Tons of them. I think I'll recast this rock. No, I'm not Batman anymore. Yeah. You're sleeping way too much, man. Sleeping on the job, you know? What do you play on? I'm on PlayStation right now. You play Fishing Planet? They sleep now, watch. Nah, but you're sipping way too much yoga. You're sipping boats day and night, you know, you're missing out, bro. Yeah. What do you play on, Cody? Xbox, PC, PlayStation. I don't want to jinx today, but I don't want to say today if you're promising. I don't want to say that. Nice, nice. What level are you? And as I said, bro, if you're promising, and that's what I get, you know? Like, hey man, come on, bro. Come on, bro. Now that's wonderful right there, you know, I call it and it happened. Nice, yes sir, I think like 25, oh. So like, you know, what map have you been fishing and grinding? Okay, I see I see the match for taking off. Oh, look who's asking questions, chat. The guy that stands in front of me the entire time. Lovely. <laughs> hey man, crazy. <laughs> Blue Cup Island? Oh, so you're good then.
you're supposed to be good bro you know you just fish the right spots right peak time and you should be good to go man this place is a really good place to grind but you have to put the time in you know so many things to go here for spec a pick up bass get really big 21 25 pounders i think drums snooks striped bass <laughs> i hate that catfish but a nice one man you know i think i might try for the flounder though in the meantime flounders drums maybe then we can move on With bobbers or that lower? One second, y'all. <clears throat> Am I spelling this thing right? I hope so. Oh my god, I spelled bait spot instead of a has, there's a D at the head. I got to go. Hey, Cody, I appreciate you stopping by, bro. You know. If you want to see more of this stream, hit that subscribe button if you want to, you know. Maybe we can fish sometimes. But as I said, I appreciate you stopping by the stream, you know. Oh, I just missed. I did. Thank you, bro. I hey, stay safe, you know. See the next one. What well, life bait? Yeah, this guy's picking our brains right now, but hey, that's what we do. We help, you know. I don't think you have these baits, though. Not gonna lie to you. I might be pushing this day way too far, but I do feel like this day could be like a double unique day, you know? It could be a day where you catch double uniques today. Like, the reason why I said that, it's a good peak time. We got a lot of peak time remaining as well. And the fish are biting, you know? So there's a possibility. However, though, I might change spots, you know, might. Surprisingly, we haven't caught a parameters yet. I would say though, today's been a lot of uh, low-level players fishing this map. Maybe they're all trying to get to a distant level. So when the saltwater map comes out, they, they're good to go, you know. Is this a place good for my level or is it too high?
single question. Okay, I know he's going to keep asking questions to be honest, and that's going to distract me from fishing. But if I can help, I will. Oh, damn, it's 7 p.m. Crazy. I was thinking of doing another late night stream to wrap up Red Dead Redemption, and uh, I might do that. Might. Just a thought, no, nothing I can actually say is foolproof. Is he still by the mangroves? He's still there, bro. I think I might want to change parts now. I saw a TikTok to go in a spot. In the top right of the map, and the mina goes spot. Yeah, I'm not sure what spots are there in TikTok, but uh, I'm pretty sure they're similar to what I know of. Pretty sure. <laughs> Nope, it's still the same way, bro. Crazy. I imagine if I use this rod right here, I'll be heading for a, a, a day of chaos right there, bro. Feed the rod, 14 pound. Yeah, good luck with that crap. Okay, I'm not in his way, and he's not in my way, not quite, you know, we're chilling. Wait, how many rods is on that rod stand? Three? I thought it was two, bro. I thought it was a two older. I don't know you can fit three. Wait, what? You can. No, is that possible? Uh, 
I don't think I've ever seen that one before. I chat. I was just about to say that I'm looking for at least one more unique when we already got one. I was seriously thinking about saying that. So now we just have to keep fishing this thing, or maybe not, but we can just spend a bait coin. Or we can just skip days, you know. Unless I'm not down to spend bait coins. But if we come down to like a situation where we have to, then I don't do that, you know. Yeah, this guy is not listening, bro. We told him buzz bait with the X-Series names, and uh, he, I don't think he, he had to listen to us. And the thing is, I wasn't the only person who recommended Dutch also did, and uh, it seemed like he didn't realize that it was actually the best bait to fish here. Don't you dare go for it, drum. Don't you dare go for it. Oh, look, he have a fish on, but he's not taking up the rod. What is he doing? Typing? I mean, actually, that's going to be a fish. Yeah, he can't get the fish on. It's on the match rod. What is he doing, bro? Wait, is it reeling? Okay. He's typing, he lost the fish from typing. All that. He lost the fish, bro. Tough. He's asking what the level is by my name. How can I explain that now? In in typing. I'm just say extra rank, you know. It's extra ranked, man. Nothing that serious. I think that's okay. I think that's good enough, right? Back in my days, I used to think the extra levels that becoming rank is from competitions. I, I seriously think that way. When I see players with that extra number, I always think it's from competitions, man. I will say, not too many drums today. Of course, we caught some uniques now and then, but I was honestly expecting more to be biting. Definitely. Oh, we just missed the fish right there. Uh, 
Let me ask you what lowers they have. Wait, where is that fashion to get snooks in the gizzard shot area? Oh, we had a fish, bro. I didn't realize it. I was typing and fishing. Not the best combinations, man. Not the best combinations, man. Especially when you're like lower fishing. It's never good to be typing while fishing, bro. You never know what's going to take the lower or when. Yeah, I'm on uh, PlayStation, bro. <laughs> and pepperoni pizza, welcome to the stream, bro. <laughs> hey, man. I kind of dig the name, you know? It's a cool name. Something unique. Can you add me? Yeah, I can add you. Uncommon peanut. Holy crap, bro. <laughs> okay, let me see. Let me see. Wait. Okay. <clears throat> what level are you? And common. Oh, you said peanut. Oh man. Level six to nine, bro. Are you trolling me? Or are you just saying that, bro? I can't. I can't tell if you're serious. You know. <clears throat> okay, you are. Wait, is that thing in behind your name, or is just? Uh, I'm gonna see if that's gonna work. Search. I think I might have typed your name wrong. Yeah. The nine should be close by, right? Yeah. Okay, there you go. Okay, so you're almost the level to fish. Uh, well, yeah, actually had the level to fish the Amazonian maze, to be honest. Yeah, we're not getting that fish. It's gonna be glitched out, man. It's a pretty nice fish, but they won't give it to me. Yep, see? That's a unique right here, guys. What this? Oh, they actually give it to me? Okay, it wasn't so unique. If it was a unique, probably they would have like not given me that fish, you know? Uh there is one more space in the lobby. I thought it was a unique way that was going crazy, but I guess not. Most times when I when I'm in the pause menu, oh, and there's a fish on at the moment. When I go to take it up, it never like most times. It's never working for me. And we're getting the most fish in our net right there. 
We're making the most out of every day. Yo, Art, welcome back, bro. Oh. <laughs> I seriously thought it was a shad. Catch any uniques? Yep. I've caught a nice um, tarpon so far today. This day I'm fishing. So that's, I think, four tarpons. It's four to two now. Two days no tarpon uniques. And uh, four days we got tarpons to bite. Two for four or four for two, if that makes sense. <laughs> and now we might be going on a little longer than we think today. Oh, come on. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, nice fish right there. Nice fish right there. Oh, it's a primate. Lovely. Hey, anything to get our backpack full, you know? Oh, yeah. You see, that's exactly what I was facing earlier. And common peanut. Yeah, uh, you know. Yeah, he's in the way right there. But, hey, uh, man. Maybe you can say, like, you know, make space and uh, you, you might be able to. I think he's screwed, though. The feeder rod. And he's, he's I think he's fighting a big permit. Yeah, that's going to be a problem for him right there. You lost it. Yep. Feed the rods, man. Tough. Trophy. I think what it should be doing is just only use the match rod and the casting rod to fish with. Those are the only thing that would be giving him a chance to get uniques and trophies here. The only thing. I don't think I've caught over a thousand pounds of fish today. I could have, but I chose to just fish the days, daytime peak wise, and uh, once that it's 9 p.m., basically over for the day, I just skipped on. But if I really wanted to fully ski net today, or any days I've been fishing, that's simple. I think he actually start using the, the the casting rod and just the match rod. I think he's catching on, man. That's good, you know. You don't realize that the feeders are letting the fish go 
too quick, you know. They're not uh, keeping up with the fight. So I think he's actually learning that that's what he's, he's supposed to be doing right now. Oh, oh, oh. He was typing, but it's the message. I think you're right. My riser broke. Oh, oh, he did break them. What are the best fish here? Tarpons, drums, bass, permits, you know. Uh, let's see, snooks are okay. Unless, bro, you got so many fish here to go for, and they're pretty good. It's a map of Unix, bro. Tons of them. You got big mob buffaloes there too. You got gigantic uh, gars. Bowfins, like, but those fish now are like fish you go for after grinding, you know. But I love, I love to go for the bass there though. Really big. So Dutch have one unique so far. I'm gonna give them a few more uh, days to fish, and uh, yeah, gonna take a break right there. I'll be here though. Give me more time to do my testing, more time to spend with you guys watching, you know, overall more time to fish. I just don't want you guys to get bored of me doing the same thing because I'm not really going for everything. So I'll be mainly in one or two spots fishing today for the same fish. Come on. I think he's typing. Maybe he can put something with that buzz bait too, bro. Something extra. Should I buy more of the Majesty? <laughs> yeah. If you if if you were at the right level, I would say yes. But you're not even close to buying them. The only way he's gonna buy them is either for big coins or another DLC. And I'm not and I'm not gonna recommend him do that, bro. I don't want to be the 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 person who they're gonna blame to spend real money in the game, bro. I'm not gonna be that person, no sir. Damn branch, crazy. I have got some decent money now. I have 89 Bitcoins and 100k something. 
Yes, sir. At the level you are at right now, that 100k will be so easy to spend off, bro. So, you know, at this point, it's better to grind uh, both cash and XP, bro. You're gonna need it. That's something, those two, those uh, two things right there will be hand to hand. The two most important things gonna be needed. However, though, the moment you get to these maps, like you know, uh, Weeping Willow, Blue Cup Island, cash won't be that. Uh, what can I say? That bad to get it won't be such a big problem. But for now, at your level, yeah, you need both of that, man. Both of them. Oh my god, bro. Catfish won't leave me alone today, huh? Oh, that's a nice knock right there, bro. 37 pounds. You rarely see anyone catch snooks that are that big. It's either 32, 35, or 37. That's a nice one. Oh, our repeat them is over, y'all. On to the next one, right? Okay, so at max, most days, it's one unique tarpon per day. Most days. What's crazy is my, my lantern is always turned off. Why? Oh snap, bro. This day would be a tough one. I might skip over this one. The better peak time is in the morning, but I don't want to spend bait coins just to fish it. Another one. Come on. Oh my god, bro. Really? They're pretty much every, all the same. What big cons are for? You got plenty of options. You can buy rods, reel, line, bait, skip days. Uh, you can buy boats too. You know items like that, but I mainly use my bay coins for skipping days, buying lowers. That's it. They're not quite easy to get, unless you can be grinding missions or spend money on the game. But they're really important to have in the game, bro. Especially when you're grinding, you're gonna be needing them. Okay, guys, I'm not going to be lying to you guys, but uh, this day might not be the best time to fish this peak time, you know. I got like 21, 22 mil. Not much, you know. Don't get me wrong though, y'all. I, I just skipped over the day because there's not much peak time to fish. It's good. But I prefer not to uh, fish that day. I wouldn't fish that day unless it's the morning peak time.
surprising I didn't actually lose any XP for that fish right there. Bacon. <laughs> You know, I'm sending a marker, bro, just so he can cast in the right area. I think he's casting the wrong area, to be honest. Now I was sending that marker, bro. I think he's actually casting in the wrong area, to be honest. If you notice, his rods are pointing to the right. Not the best place to be pointing uh, his rods right now. Something was messing with my bait. Oh, you saw it? I have like more things to buy. So sometimes auto, like you know, when you unlock certain things, they're not necessarily things to buy with cash. They can be big coins, you know. Not everything in the game is for cash. So Sometimes you unlock things is for Bitcoin as well. Oh. Hey, what should I call you, bro? And common peanut nine? I'm not sure, you know. <laughs> Yo, what would you like to be called, man? The name you prefer, you know? No, no, not you, Otto. Call me Peanut. Okay. Well, where have I heard that name before? It's in a cartoon, bro. I think the cartoon is Hans. Where so with this guy, it, they turned him into a small hand, bro, because he was a bully, right? He used to uh, spray water in the ant's nest, right? And they turned him into a, a hand. It was a human, and they call him Peanut. If you guys are familiar with that um, cartoon right there, I got to go. Good luck. Enjoy fishing. Hey man, GG's bro. You know, next time we can maybe fish again. If if that's possible, you know. And that thanks for stopping by the stream, you know. Yeah, I, I swear there's a cartoon like that, bro. I swear it. You know, surprisingly I sent him the marker, but he's not casting in the area. Not sure why. Hey man, I tried to help, you know. I tried, bro. How long been fishing for? Okay. We might fish one more day. Hopefully next day will be a day to fish. 
and we can call it right there. I told him to cast Sport Rise in that direction, but uh, he's only using one of them. I'll see you next on Saturday night. Honestly, bro, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I will be streaming tomorrow. Not much to really do on stream for fishing plant anymore. So I'm not sure if it's gonna be tomorrow fishing plant stream, but maybe you know. Sunday maybe. There is there is nothing I have planned or looking forward to. Other than um, recatch all the fish on a certain map. So I'm not quite sure, bro, what it's going to be for the upcoming fishing plan streams next time. Can't say. Oh, ho, ho. <coughs> Okay, Dutch cut is unique right there. You know, we caught a few of them. Catfish, snook, drum. Okay, so when I leave, I can actually say that, you know, it was a pretty good day. We got some uniques today, you know. That's what I wanted to see right there. Peanut didn't fish that much, but I think if it, if it was here, it would have got some nice uniques too. A hey, nice one, Dutch. Nice one. Is there a way for me to give you two guys for helping me? <laughs> hey, that's kind of right there. But hey, I'm all good, man. Come on, come on, there you go. What is this? Oh, not a monster. Hey, but you know, even though I said I have no plans for tomorrow Fishing Planet stream, if you guys have any suggestions, I'm open to them. I might try them out, I might not. You know? But I'm open to suggestions, man. If you guys have any uh, maps or what you guys want to see. Alright, bro. I'm going to be off now. Okay, Otto, take it easy, man. You know. Keep up the grind. When I can, I will stop by. Just keep fishing, you know. When you get the time to. Yeah, how many of these units I've caught today, you guys? How many units uh, catfish I've caught today? Crazy. Yo, what's up with everyone? <laughs> hey, man. <laughs> what's up with everyone got this dog in their name, you know? Like, every, so, so far there's two players today. 
with that same name, you know? Okay, is this a monster? I don't think it is. It's not fighting like one. Wait, is that silk or thick? I think that's silk. I think I think he meant something else, but maybe they wasn't giving him the uh, maybe they, they wasn't giving him the name to choose. I don't know. See why my light keep turning off, bro? Like I don't know why. Yo, Among Us, what's good, bro? Welcome to the stream, man. I don't think this is a unit, guys. But if it is, it's like something under 120. I don't think it is, though. Damn, my hands are tired today, bro. Not gonna lie. It's been pure action today. Pure action, man. Quirky. Oh my god, bro. Why stop with everyone being so weird with their names, man? What's going on? I doubt nowadays you can find anyone with a name that makes sense, bro. Once you pronounce it, it's either you're, you're smiling, wondering why they named themselves that way, but hey man, nowadays things are way different, you know? I've seen some user names that maybe even the player who chose a name can't pronounce it, I swear it. Where is this fish going? Right or left? It's about to be night time. Is that guy in my spot, bro? No shot, right? I think we're good. No, we're good, we're good. Which other? Bottom rods. Is that two bottom rods to match rods? Okay, that's good. Oh. Fish on. Two fish on, by the way. Here we go, here we go. Slide them across. What do we get? A 126 pound uni. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Yes, sir. Now we can skip on ahead. Yeah, 
I'm gonna just say it, bro. It's officially back waking grind tar prints now. It's official, bro. Maybe you guys weren't familiar with these fish not biting back then that much anymore on live baits, but for me, they weren't. But now I can say, yes, they're back, you know. They might not be no monsters, but uh, if a few days fishing there, you can get majority of those days unique to bite on them. Then what else can you ask for, you know? Especially if you're grinding this map. How long I've been playing this? Since 2019? So tw three and a half years maybe? I would say that. Let's just say three years to be honest. The thing is I have two accounts, you know, so I spend different time on both of these accounts fishing. Hey man, that's been playing since 2017. No way, man. Crazy. <clears throat> we'll get to the buy for sure. Come on, there you go. You know, sometimes when I see players say them they've been playing since PC days 2017, I'm like. Holy crap, bro. Where have I been, you know? Like, if I was fishing from way back then, bro, I could imagine the, the amount of knowledge I would have had by now fishing this game. I'm still learning, you know? I'm just a regular player who's just sharing what I know so far. But every day I learn something new while fishing. Every day. Okay, what do we have here? Could this be another unique y'all? I'm not convinced though. Not quite convinced, you know. Damn, it's 50, well, it's 7.50. 10 minutes to 8 p.m. right now. I was definitely not uh planning to stream this long today is there a way for me to buy crabs again they weren't the were the baits that work for me really good maybe maybe big coins but damn bro i don't want to recommend them but uh, if you if you think you can buy them then that's all is Twice right there, you know. That's a uni. One twenty one. Twenty one. <laughs> <coughs> I'm 
Mm, let me get this fish in first. Fish. Okay. A nice trap bass Dutch. Damn. 51. Holy crap. Hey, I should be the one saying nice one right now, but uh, kind of busy, you know. Okay, I think someone's trying to find a spot to fish. Yeah, tough, bro. I love to see everyone just fishing together and enjoying the day, bro. Like, love seeing that, as always. Quirky. Wait, what fest is that? The 4th of July? Or that's something different? Question guys, I don't think you can buy Bitcoin bait if you're not at the right level, right? I don't think they won't allow you to get them. You can't uh, get them that way if you don't unlock them. So I don't think you can. I don't think he's gonna make it back in this lobby. I think someone might take his place, most likely. I think I've lost count on the, the unique tarpon today. But majority of the days I've fished, I've at least got one unique tarpon. Majority of them. Uh oh. Someone broke a leader. Unique drum right there. Trophy. A trophy, maybe. I think I have one more day to fish, man. Then we're calling it right there. Of course, our last day might not give us the unique, but hey, man, I think it's time to take a break, you know. I bought the crowd for 19. Oh, you did get them done.
Yeah, this is going to be a trophy. I'm going to say 75 to 80. You know, surprisingly, he actually made it back in the lobby without his place being taken. Surprisingly. Monster permit right there. Let's see if he's going to set his run stands this time around. You know, if he's going to set them correctly or the same way as the way before. I mean, if he wants to go further up, he can do that. This is part, you know. Guess who's back? Otto is back. <laughs> yeah, what's good, bro? I thought we were taking some nap or something by now or just, you know, being busy. Come on, come on. Oh my god, that's a unique right there, bro. That's a big unique right there. We're not gonna get it though. Oh my god, bro. Damn. That was a unique snook right there. Definitely. If this was in real life, someone could net that fish really fast or gaff him really fast. But, uh, yeah. Yo, everyone is packed with action right now. Come on, bro, get that fish in. You got this, bro. I think it's time for, uh, what's his name? Boss Baby. <laughs> to get some nice trophies and uniques, you know. I think it's time for him to get some. Oh, we have a bite. Yeah. From the way he took the bait, I knew he was going to spit the lure. Could just tell. Uh oh. Who's tarping is that out there? He's a boss, baby. Little weird. Oh my. Look at the fish in the water, guys. No, that's Quirky's fish right there, the tarpon. Yep. Wait, where is okay? Still fighting the fish. Should be able to write. I think he can definitely reach fifty. 
what the DLC Tommy has on this map. He can definitely do it. I can't tell if he's fighting a fish or not. I can't tell. Okay, the last day is coming up here. Fingers crossed we can get a unique here for the tarpon. You got a nice unique, bro. Not unique, but nice trophy. If I don't get one on this day that's coming up, I might make an exception to keep going. Just because I would love to have a unique to end it on, you know. This day might not be the best part. This peak time might not be the best day to fish right here. I'd recommend fishing the, the barge out there on the day I'm fishing right now. But let's risk it, you know. Just dropped the heat bomb and third place on the Shika Island. Yes, sir. What weapons are you using to play with? What's your, you know? Oh, that's unique right there, guys. That should be unique right there. Isn't that a unique? It wasn't? Why did it seem way bigger in my screen? As I said y'all not this spot I should be fishing this peak time but uh let's give it a, a go and see hey Alan isn't Ashika Alan only on um quads right now LLB or you sniping? I think the PDSW, that's the, the P90. So you're sniping and uh okay that's what is I I see what you're playing bro. <coughs> oh we missed it bro come on wait was that my fish I missed? Just took a shower and up on MW2. Crazy, crazy. By the time you're finished, DD, you're sweaty again, man. It's Call of Duty, you know? <laughs> I, hope you dig I hope you do get it, bro. Yeah, it's only Quartz and Ashika Island. I think everything else is on um, Vondel. Yeah, that's gonna be a unique permit right there unless what I'm seeing is not what what's there I don't know the thing is with quads Allen is like you know you have to have some good teammates that won't die and leave instantly I hate when it happened. So I'm surprised that you're having a good day playing quads. I was going to get rust. Then I realized the game caused 
cancer and pain. Yeah, I don't think Rusty got to have a, a, a team or a squad to play with, bro. I don't think so. Come on, come on. There you go. I'm more like a trios guy. No one did not play solos. But when it comes down to quads, I like playing quads over doors. It's just that, you know, you, you find a team and it's just like, they die, they leave. And sometimes it's only you versus the entire squad, bro. You know. It's a pain, but you can find some good teammates out there. You should see resurgence tonight. <laughs> oh, you think it's that easy, huh? Yeah, Didi, you crazy, bro. Okay, then. We might lose a few fish right here. Lift the rod high. Get this one in, and there you go. Quick, quick, you know. I wonder though if you know streaming Call of Duty day versus night, which is easier, like less sweaty. For me, I normally stream at daytime, where I'm more energetic. I got more time to play and stuff like that, you know. Night time for me is always like, how can I say, when I play offline, it's always not the best time to do that for me. Oh, that might be a nice fish right there. Come on, Permit. Stop playing dumb. Come on in, bro. Damn. We might lose a fish. Oh my god, bro. The moment I say it, bro. Come on, man. Stupid fish was right there. And he just swam right by. Really? I'm using a 88 pound rod and a 60 pound permit. Is destroying me. How is that possible? What? Come on, man. I guess I'm not the only one catching catfish today. <laughs> yes, sir. So we just lost a unique permit right there. Guarantee. Now here comes the catfish, bro. The moment I said nice one to Dutch, I got one. Karma. Yep. I see boss baby turning up right now. He's getting fish in. He finally found out the rods he should be using. Now we should just get to level 30 to get those large minnows. And it should be on a smooth sailing right there. It should be good to go. Oh my god, bro. What's this? Not a catfish? Yeah, Dutch is going to get payback. Yep, yep, mm-hmm.
Oh my god, I was just about to say it, but uh, you made it before me, bro. <laughs> hey, no shot. <laughs> yeah, I made it in I made it to a lady, bro. Crazy. Hey Dutch, you're lucky that my typing is slow, you know? You said nice one, that's just two letters, but I say don't say it, it's gonna take me a while to type it. Crazy. But who's fish is that? Boss baby is on? Yes sir. Come on, that might be a trophy right there. You got this, bro. Nighttime is when the sweaty kids get on. That's That was my best cut of the year. Got my first gold skin. It level 150 plus and I've gotten better. You know, most players will assume that nighttime is when everyone is more sweaty because everyone is at home, you know. But I don't really think that's quite the, the case, to be honest, but it can be. It can be. As I said, I played offline, not online streaming, so I can't really say what's better, but one day I will find out, man. Okay, we got this tarpon to, to get. But maybe this this spot is not the spot to get it, you know. When I do have the time or you know the energy to stream at night time for Call of Duty, I might give it a try. But uh, I don't think it will be anytime soon though. I'll play offline at night, but streaming? Nah. I don't think so. I don't want to be raging, yelling, going crazy in the night, you know. Yeah, I think that's Dutch favorite fish right there, the snucks. Definitely. I'm honestly thinking of moving spot. Wish I might. But is it too late though? That's my question. Should I have gone there fishing from the early state of the peak time? Or is it too late for me? Hey, if it's your favorite fish, you're going to be knowing the time, the bait, the spot, the exact thing to get them, you know? Definitely. Are we still fighting the fish? Where is he? Oh no, he's still here. Did he get the fish in? Tarpon? Okay. Yeah, I think I might not be in the peak time to skip uh, spots right now. So I'm going to just sit it out right there. Oh my god, permits, permits, permits. Crazy. What was that? <laughs> I 
Wait, is Alin up here in offline playing Call of Duty? I don't see you online, bro. Everyone is rocking the buzz bait. This guy right here. Maybe this guy too, I can't say. But I'm pretty sure Dutch is rocking the buzz bait. I am. And uh boss baby. I'm pretty sure we are rocking the buzz bait, man. The thing is, I feel like if I move from this part right now, someone's gonna move right into the area I'm fishing and uh coming back here will not be the best for me, you know finding this pot again so I guess we have to go on to another day if by the end of today we don't get the unique to bite the f tax siege is akimbo is out of hand oh what the hell Yes, they are. 72 run mag with both weapons, bro. And you can rock ghosts with them because they're pistols, you know? Crazy. Yeah, if you know what you're doing with those weapons, bro, you can get some good eye kill match with them. Really good eye kills. I personally though is not a really not really a fan of them. I really try them. I tried the mini not the mini the single uh I've talked before. But maybe one day I will try again someday. Oh, come on, come on. There you go. What is this? Uh, big in or no? <laughs> I wish it was. I wish it was the unique, bro. Reminds me of Wars of One Virgin. Yeah, you did have a few uh, rapid pistols there. The Sky of, or this, is it? Psychov, my bad. With an 80 round drum mag on them. That thing was deadly back then, though. Deadly. Even though the Siege kind of reminds me of the Mac 10, though. <laughs> what? You call my spot short? Oh, no way, Dutch. Crazy, crazy. <clears throat> Wait, you never fished here before? Okay, I'm gonna send over a marker in a minute. Give me a second. Wait, is it shot spot or short spot? I'm not I'm not sure what spot you're talking. Is it this one or by the the boat dock, you know? Let me know. I might be thinking of something different, bro. <laughs> so when when you say short bro I thought it was talking I, I thought you were saying that this spot is bad like you know it not not a bad way where you can't fish but since it's this active it's like you know 
Yeah, never mind, bro. It's for me to explain it. It will be uh, too many things to say. But yeah, I think it was shad. Okay, let me send you down. Oh. Okay, one spot. One, one second. I'm even saying the wrong words right now, right? Come on, bro. There you go. To the left of the boat dock? Okay. I got you. Is it is it right here? I think so. You can fish very close to it. Uh, I think this part is Josh right here. I don't really cast that far. I don't think you have to cast that far to get them. But let me just send it just in case you want to cast there too, you know. I think you're really close by. You don't want to be casting a few hundred meters, or not meters, but feet out there to get them to bite. Hey, DD, be careful of the word you say, man. But what's wrong with the PSDW? You know that it's a really good weapon, right? It's actually not a bad weapon to use. Fast fire rate, tons of ammo, and they got range on it. Will he come into the bait? What is it? Catfish. Crazy, is it? Okay, maybe not. He didn't run with the bait, so I couldn't tell. It's a literal cheat code. The thing is, Didi, like, I don't think you got tons of SMG that are pretty good in the game. What's hard for players to find is the hair, primary weapons, you know. You got the Vel 47. Is it the Vel 7 or Vel 47? I can't say. MP7. Let's say that. The PSDW. The FSS Hurricane. Those are like the underlook SMGs, right? They're pretty good, but players don't really use them because of the the ISO 45, new SMG, the MP5, and the Vaznev. But once those weapons get nerfed too bad, then it's going to go to the, the PSDW and the other weapons, bro. So many options to choose from. Riot Shielders, yeah, I hate those players, bro. There is always one camper in the game that's always going to get you. No matter how good you are, there is this one camper that will always get you, bro. Doesn't have to be Riot Shielder. Could just be anyone playing cheeky. Anyone. Okay, I'm just going to say this. No matter what fish we get tomorrow, unique or not, I'm ending it right there, bro. Not going to lie to you guys. I think it's full time to take a break, man. I think it's hitting the spot where I have to definitely stick by my word and just end it right there. 
Actually, if I catch any unique right now, it doesn't matter what fish. Please don't be a catfish, though. I will take it and end uh, the stream, you know. What the hell is going on, bro? Not gonna lie to the was supposed to be the call to the stream. But I've been getting comments when am I going live. They didn't say what game though. So of course I had the the option to choose what game I want to play. But you guys know bro. You guys don't really want to watch Call of Duty, you know? I can 100% say that. You guys don't want to watch the Call of Duty streams. Especially on planet, or you're not stopping by, you know? That's just it. Okay, this might be your ticket to end the stream, guys. This might be the unique right here. It's not fighting that one, though. Yes, finally, okay, I was, you know, don't end on a tarpon, but hey man, I gotta go, bro. I need to take a 50 right now, one hour break, you know, then I might make another choice after. Yes, sir. Let me just say GG's to everyone because, you know, yeah, it's that time. How long have been streaming for? Five and a half hours. Crazy. You had a 6KD. You had it. But well, what happened to it, bro? I love carrying my teammates. I don't know about that one right there. I remember you said it, you know. Okay, guys, y'all know what time it is. No problem, nice fishing. Yeah, I just wish you, you joined up earlier, Dutch. You know, so we could fish more. Definitely. But it's been five and a half hours right now. Why Quirky keep breaking his line, bro? Crazy. Just take a, a small stroll while we're wrapping up everything. If you guys have any questions or anything to say before I go, let me know, man. Today's been a wonderful day in Fish and Planet. I will definitely say that. Everyone basically got some unique, some trophies. I got some nice ones too, you know. Met some new players, new viewers too. You know, been a great day as I said. Wait, is that your question? Is my head five feet wide, bro? Oh my god, man. Yeah, it is, bro. I got mega mind head, you know? Yeah, my IQ is over a thousand. I wish it was. Crazy question, DD. Okay, okay, let's do this. First of all, I can officially say that Unique Tarpons are back. They're now used to grind again. They're biting. You know, in the past, players have been asking where better to fish or to grind, which is between Weeping Willow and Blue Crab Island. Both are good. Both have their ups and downs, unique wise, trophy wise, bite rates, beat. So you know, at the end of the day, even if I recommend one map to you guys, it might not be the best one you're thinking or are going for. But because I know and fished these maps before, I can say it, stick with what I said, you know. However though, as I said, at the end of the day, it's what you go for. 
So it's back to being two contenders. Weeping Willow, Blue Crab Island. So I would say both of them can be grinded at the same time. If you're high enough level to, to be fishing both of them. You know. The biggest difference between them is that one map need special baits and mix to fish the harder. Not quite. You just use regular baits to fish there and you're good to go. But I'm not going to get into that topic right now, you know. We came here to Blue Cup Island. We got some Unix to bite. Majority of the days, they're biting. And not to mention the other Unix too. Drums, permits, bonefish, snook. You know they're all here. It's a fun map. Great bite rate. Tons of fish to catch. You know. So it's still up there for the players who are 50 to 55 level grinding. But, but for the past few months, I've been here with live baits. Nothing really bites in unique wise for the tarpon. But now today, I can officially and guarantee saying that they're back. Back in business and biting like there's no tomorrow. Yo, Fork, what's good, man? Enjoy, Britty. You heard it? Yes, sir. I appreciate it, man. With that said guys, thanks to everyone who stopped by today's stream, dropping a like, watching, you know, sharing their thoughts, just having a good day, holding conversations with us, fishing with us as well. But you know, at some point, it all has to end, right? And that's where we're at right now, the end of the day, the end of the stream. So my apology for ending, but I gotta take a break, you know. So you guys stay safe, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.